What's up, people? We got Uni2 Slashback 2024. We got a big top 48. This is the one of the most stacked top eights we've seen in a while. Like, mm -hmm. I mean, obviously besides the crossover which happened last weekend, oh, this yeah. is an event where a lot of the killers decided to roll through, and basically all of West Coast decided to show up. Yeah, we got every name name. Almost all of them are in this yep. top 48. A few, few here and there not, you know, mystery players. But so many are in, so many are in winners. We see classics, we see new faces. I, I was going to say, there's a lot of these, like, classic names that you see while actually in the loser side of the bracket mm -hmm. that mm -hmm. are like, oh, that's actually a big upset. Yeah, we were just talking before this, uh, Poppy Seed, Casey beating Smiles. Oh, yeah. That's a huge upset mm -hmm. in that pool to make it onto that winner's side, which we'll probably be seeing them a little bit later. Yeah. Um, but, yeah, this, this top 40 is nothing but amazing. Make sure to stay tuned for the entire time because we got good matches now. We, we got, got good matches, matches later. In the we got good matches in two hours, yes. people. And we, then we got top eight. Yeah. yeah. Oh. Uh, and we've got a really good match right here. Clear Lamp versus Squish. A classic ancient match. You can find this in the textbooks. Written about articles. Yeah. Newspapers. The and, whole shebang. And these are players playing basically the same characters since you've seen them. You'll, yeah. If you go, if you Google.com, Clear Light versus Squish, you're going to find this matchup in mm -hmm. every single game. You see this fight two com two versions ago. Yep. You don't see this fight last version, but you know what? It's fine. Yeah, yeah, you're yeah. seeing this fight, this version, powered up characters. Yes. Powered up. Super Saiyan. You well, saw, I, you saw Goku. Mm -hmm. Okay, way so back then. Byakuya definitely slight downtrend. I'll be real. Slight she's got, she's downtrend. Got the funny tutu move. Funny, though. funny tutu. Tutu sick, right? Yeah. But Akatsuki in this version Super is a, is He's a character to be reckoned insanity. with. Insanity. Not prepared. Insanity. That guy holds nine. You're praying. <laughs> you're afraid for your yeah. life. I don't think Clear Lamp doesn't look afraid though. No, but you know, I like, like his, I like his ready face. The, the last couple times Clear Lamp has been to America, he hasn't like. Play isn't super no, super far, no. and he's like, we've seen these matchups of people coming in and like upsetting them, which I don't think is a detriment to Clear Lamp's skill. It's just the the level of NA oh, yeah. has gotten so much better. NA is strong. This version definitely a little volatile as well. Yeah, yeah, most definitely. You see some damage happen. It's terrifying, and it looks like the are playing. Oh my God, he's footing out of his mind. Yeah, and I mean that's gonna be the big part of this matchup, right? You're looking to just constantly control that screen space right outside of the Akatsuki 5 B2C range, because as soon as you let them get that, they can really regain control of the tempo, and Biakia can excel in that a lot. Oh yeah, he's got these big old buttons. The 5 B is just a massive stop sign. 5 A just cleanly beating a Tatsu out. Yeah, and now we see a good old reliable 100 meter. Oh no, oh, 100 yeah. meter one web. Yeah, just a little rusty having to get used to the stream setup, but we still find the force function overhead right there. Gets the chain shift up get a full confirm and he should cash out into a kill right here. Oh yeah, yeah. 20, 120. You get a little bit back. Transfer state, perfect. Really fast. He's just, he's doing kind of good. Oh my. Okay, that's a pretty good rough cancel. Yeah. That's I, a pretty good rough cancel. Yeah, Plus frames, hit, combo. In the, Piaki in the corner, what are you gonna do? Yeah, He's got th a DP. Th this is the Akatsuki win condition that you're looking for. Oh, great shield on that 6C e right there. Like, obviously, 6C e is a little bit hard to punish at that range, so just make sure that you guarantee it, find your off goal routing, and guarantee a side swap as well. Oh, yeah. Now you just get to cash out some more meter. The 25 back for free. We got two webs this time. Maybe a, a little safer. Air parry, nice option to clear the web. Yeah, you can, uh, being able to like cancel out of that in case you see them trying to go for something in the middle, but you even see clear line just spacing it out far on the edge mm -hmm. and then waiting for situations like this. Yeah, Squish tried to tag that web, but 2B just went under it, got hit for it. Still, just two webs got overhead Ooh. instantly. Squish shielding, there's really greedy. Yeah, I'm not entirely certain on like the decision process right there because you don't have ground shield. Like if you have the ground web shielding there can generally be a pretty safe option just to gain the the grid. You do have to worry about the You have to worry about throw and overhead, yeah, yeah. but there it's like the web wasn't there to meet you, so you're just you're able to chill, but immediate shield is really scary. Oh, clear lamp's just hidden now. Yeah, we are. Oh, oh. But he's just hidden now. How many are you gonna take? But honestly, it might not be that bad. Like, if you can force them to give you that screen pressure and then you find your big opening to get a side swap, yeah. you can really make a lot work. No green shield right there, so Squish not. Oh, oh no! no. Back. That's so unfortunate. Yeah. Squish, Squish got the cycle. It was a really solid round for that, that point. Could have made it really good getting that grid break. Yeah. But now, 
in the corner, put it onto the cycle. What are you going to do? Oh, oh you're going to get tagged by 2C. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I was going to say that. Uh, and right now, I think Clearlamp is just playing very cautiously. Like, I think they have the reason they've been going for those double one subs is because they haven't need to go for the complex triple web sets. Because you're just able to play this very, very calm stagger button game and find these opportune punish times against Squish. Yeah, Squish is just getting hit by stuff. Yeah, and it was like right at the start of their dash. Like their dash block was right yeah. there. So Clearlamp having that right timing. And you're not even seeing counter hits. It's just like you're just getting hit on the movement. You're just trying to do something, try to get out. And you're just getting tagged by the timings. It's, Squish is not able to be done doing a ton. Spending some meter, getting the neutral controlled a little bit. But, oh, there's yeah. the counter hit. All right. Clearlamp just, he's doing his game. Yeah, I mean, this, this is what Clearlamp has been doing for half a decade. This is how yeah. he's wanted to pilot this character. Squish does find a way to get out of the corner, though, and finds oh, a big yeah. 2 succeed. Oh, yeah. You just get your plus frames. You get your fireball going. You get some damage out. Nice throw. A little scary. Very close timing there. Yeah. And he's just afraid you lay. Oh, big counter, but... If you could pick that up, it would have been huge, but right now you have to find another big opening. Yeah. Oh, that shield was really scary. Clamp tried to edge out the cycle. Not able to. The pressure on Raikatsuki. Oh, just too slow on the frame drop. Tatsu connecting. Squish is getting so many little hits, but finally a combo. Takes the round. And I think that's huge. Like, it's a big momentum swing being, I like, just constantly pressed again and again and again. Finding those right opportunities. Finding those situations that you actually get an open clear lamp up. The situations are good, but if you're not capitalizing, it's not going to be a ton. That round eked out, but you know, you got a whole other one to win if you want to stay alive. Clearlamp can just, oh. this round he dies, he's done. Yeah. Nice. I love that air parry right there instead of having to just hold the shield and then get guarantee air to block full. So it's showing Clearlamp not like having the full uh, protection right there. Good throw. Yeah. So it's the web one throw, more times. Yep. You see it again. Oh, nice DP. Has not represented that at all this set. So finally bring it down at these moments where you try to need to close it out. Oh, nice. it's a great punish. The FF whiffing. Normally it's really minus, but that lets Squish just dash way further up. Oh, and I love that back dash as well. After the forward tech, because a lot of people will try to get, like, dash block out of that situation. The empty into throw, not fuzzy mashing. Fuzzy throw. Squish was doing pretty good. Has a little bit of life lead. Clearly I'm trying to make his way out. Oh, Tatsu CS. Oh, big fireball hit, but nothing out of it yet. Yeah, nice air shield, and now finds their way to take the corner of their own. Squish in a much more dangerous situation because they'll get thrown. Web set above them. They have to hold this. Oh, Tried to parry him against Toss. Tries to parry. Oh, God. No, clearly just backing up like, hey, I've got, I can play the time. I can keep it cautious. <gasps> what a double, double jump and what a back dash. Oh, my God. Squish is playing some guilty gear stuff right now. All right, nice little pressure. Oh, he gets tagged by 2B. Oh, yeah. It's a good button. It's a good button. You're moving. It happens. And they're happy about it. Like, these two have played you know, yeah. so much. They're just oh, happy yeah. to you know, be able to actually play each other again at an event this far on the winner's side of the yeah. bracket. Been a while. Yeah, probably it's been like a while. At least like five years. Probably. Since 2019 would have been like probably the last time oh they played. Oh my god, 2019 was so long ago. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> back, back, pre Claire. Pre Claire. Pre Claire was probably yeah. the last time they played. Oh. Now though. Yeah. New match. Just going, staying with winners. This is a Claire classic, though. Yeah. This is Well, that was the ST classic, mm -hmm. and this is the Claire classic. We have Rakir and Snappy coming up against each other. I do want to comment one thing on that last match that I was sort of, I, I think I was processing a little bit. Mm -hmm. uh, the reason why that uh, Clearlamp was going for two web set, uh, because it was only doing that when they were at 100 meter. Oh. And so they were scared of the 236 BC, that new EX parry, oh. because they will get out of, out of the other front web as yeah, well. Yeah, you just clear this up immediately. So they were just doing web, web, and then walk back, waiting for that, waiting for that option. And the Squish never brought it to the table. Clearly, I'm so nice with it. Yeah. It's, that's so a, nice with it. That's such a nice like, recognition, because it's an option that you're not seeing Akatsuki bring a, a ton, but when it works in situations like that, it works very, very well. Sort of like roll, you know, it's like, people are like, oh, it's going to be insane, but it's a very, like, choice thing you, know, you want to be doing. You got to decide. It's There's risks involved. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Speaking of risks, Snappy has a, has a big <laughs> risk now. Yes. The choice, the choice is always upon him now. Is it going to be Wagner, or is it going to be that character with the dog that dies to 5A? <laughs> yeah. You know, there's a lot of, like, downplay on the Chaos Talk. I think that 5A nerf is huge. Yeah. Right? Like, I get oh, yeah. From a systems level, that is just a change that they made that, like, unfortunately affected Ozzy like that. Yeah. He uh, got the, the shortest draw for sure out of yes. all of them. 
Yeah, yeah. I was like, maybe Batista, because like actually being able to get counter hit now and being able to like destroy it with uh, eight gems and A normals is pretty good. That's pretty fair, though. But it's fair for what the rest of that character does. Yeah. Chaos is so reliant on having Ozzy. So I will. I think we'll probably see the Wagner on here as well, because a lot of the stuff Chaos does have to have these manual delay timings on it that get yeah. blown up by the 6FF. Uh, if Rikir is playing in Kidu, because I know they were talking about switching to Londrekia. It's a good character. It's a really good character. Kidu's a. I think he's underrepresented right now. I feel like everyone's just been like, you know, Enkidu is like. 6FF is, you know, it's kind of good. It's really good. It's, like, I it's definitely really was, good. I was really low on that move when it was when first Tessie was like, yeah, it doesn't seem that good. And then, you like, we saw um, uh, TNS last weekend uh, where Deffy just picked it, uh, picked it to do, and then 6FF the entire match, and it worked 100% of the time. It's pretty good. It's a really, really good It's pretty move. good. You have to, like, not do anything against it. I see Lundrekia selected. Yeah. You can almost back out of that menu, but, you know, oh, Backed out of it and picked Lundrekia again. They're just chatting away right now. Yeah, I think they're waiting to get that thumbs up. I think also looking for a button check potentially, you know, probably, trying to get used probably, to it. You know. Because uh, the setups are a little, I think we're playing with VSync on, which is different than a lot of the other setups that have been at events and whatnot. So it's like a half a frame extra delay or something. It's, it's, it's marginal. Marginally marginal. different. Some people will pick up on it. But I feel like those people were picking up on the screen tearing anyways, and exactly. were probably a little more bothered by that. Exactly, exactly. So we'll see. It looks like the Wagner is going to be played, and this is not a button check. We'll oh, yeah, get right into the thick of it. They're just gaming sick shield. Sick, sick shield. Snappy's already getting a big combo. You know, this is a different color for him, but, you know, I'm vibing with it. Hey, sometimes you have to bring out the new color. You know, to keep that red, keep that hotness, melt that ice with a great confirm right there. Oh, yeah. Uh, should be able to land into a uh, double buff confirm. Yeah. Nice 2-2, double buffs. Snappy was dispensing so much good of the FFs, but still has the cycle. Able to use it right now. Oh, gets hit. Yeah. Yo, oh, th th no. this is a great matchup, actually, to really talk about, like, the different meter usage that you're seeing from people on characters, but that's a great 2A confirm. Uh, Snappy is one who I, I, it definitely seems like they're willing to just cash out. <gasps> He's so lucky. Yeah. He's so lucky. I should yell at him for that right now. <laughs> he didn't spend. Meter is water. You get so much of yeah. it. Oh, it doesn't get a good shield on the, the EX Fireball. That's fine, you know? Just, like, don't get hit by one of the moves that freezes you. Oh, nice. Yeah. He's so nice. This nice little punish, he's gonna. He's not going to get a side swap. You know, it's fine. It's fine. He's 2 twoing. You, mid screen pressure. There, there it is. You yeah, know? You, you, you're getting the side swap. You're getting the mid screen side swap. It's actually beneficial for Wagner because quarter pressure can be a, a little bit harder for her to deal with while slowly showing them getting more grid. Rakir, though, does find a great 5B mash out. And going to have the cycle, should be able to proc over in the Celestial. They're able to keep it like this as well. Keep the C set. up the flower overhead on the other side. Watch out. Oh, but didn't find the pickup. So now Snappy gets uh, to regain control, but that's 6 6C going to connect. One of the buttons. One of the buttons of all time. Rakir's in the corner. Snappy with the cycle, with two buffs. Yeah. What's she gonna deal with? Oh. oh, you're not dealing with that. You're dead. Actually, that, yeah, they just hit with the mid right there. Not even a full charge overhead. Oh, yeah. Just, yeah. just like, oh, you know what? Maybe he's gonna do something a little fast. I'll hit him early. I'll hit him early, do yeah. the low. You got CS. You do, you do whatever you want at that point. Yeah, and also doing it with that, that delay partial charge timing gives you the extra active frames to be able to charge through a DP attempt right there. So it's good recognition from Snappy. Right Great here. situation. Another, ooh, good DP. You know, you saw, you saw that assault, two buttons. He saw that shield, two buttons, <laughs> good stuff to snap, the big cycle. Oh man, the 5 BP is so yes. scary. I'm and the 5A. Yeah, great recognition for what you're realizing. Okay, they don't have shield buff, this 4 function is not going to be real. going to press out of it and taking full advantage of it as well. And waiting for that DP right there. We know Snappy's not like a big DP here. I think there's someone who wants to hold on to it to save it for situations like that where they guarantee that. Oh, yeah. Oh, what a footsie. 5 BP. 5 BP, a little nasty of a button, but you know, the 2A whiff. And now you're getting the. A kill? A kill? Yeah. Didn't have to spend any meter worth as well. Get some going to the next round with a full wallet. Oh, uh, yeah. And this is sort of like what, what I was trying to get the uh, point at the beginning. Snappy, somebody wants to just dump their meter as soon as they get it, right? Because you build meter so quickly. Rakir definitely is someone who wants to save it for things like Rice Range or will save it for the full 200 and then just cash out on IW on these big keepers. Try to get that extra damage wherever they can. Yeah, well, Andrekia EX options for just 100 are quite strong. Yes. Not the strongest, though. You know, if you get your damage, you're really happy. Oh, my goodness, Snappy. What are you doing? You're just dropping stuff? You didn't shield that fireball. Well, Please don't get hit. Yeah, now you can play really patient guy with that VO being able to get the free 2 3 16 staying plus and oh, fighting some really good blocks up until the last moment. Oh, the little empty off the funny JC. So scary. Not the biggest combo, but you're in the corner. You're, you're afraid. Celestial. 
Passes it immediately. Gets your plus frames. Yeah. I, I love the respect on patience right there, I, even afterwards. Oh, not going to find the big combo confirm right here, but we'll get a solid knockdown all the way into the corner with burn route. Oh, jumps away. The dash, the funny jump yeah. FF, just not too slow. Yeah, too we, slow. We, we saw Snappy using it a lot earlier on in this, but we're here like, recognizing it and just going for the forge. jump. Good shield right there, but still no punishes. Oh, Snappy plus. back actually gets caught. The spins. Yeah, I mean, ice skating, ice skating's the name of the game with this character, right? Like, it, you got to cover so much distance for free. It's so, and, it's so fast as well. And a, a character like Wagner doesn't have the buttons to be able to punish you like that. You know, other characters can play a little bit further out and press, a, you know, Gordon 5C is a good example. Yeah, Gordon 5C, Gordon Morals, yeah. walled by unsigned buttons. Wagner has to go for, like, a shield charge or a drill or something, and those are risky. And now Snappy's just getting hit immediately. Yeah, yeah, yeah. In the corner. Watch out. Yeah, oh, yeah, that happened again! Yeah. No, the empty! This time beating out the shield. Snappy's getting hit a little too much. Yeah, we'll have to see what you do. Maybe have to pull a little bit of the wild card out right there, but we'll get frozen with the flower set. He's gonna have to hold this pressure. Good dash walks out. Just escape the corner a little bit more, but that overhead comes it's through at last minute. High. It's hit by the high. Okay, Snappy, it's set point for Rick here. Ice Storm. Nice shield there. Not enough for a punish. TP. Yeah, okay. It's yeah. good. It's good, you know? Rahir's been, like, so patient with waiting on those gaps and just allow Snappy to think, like, oh, I can still gap, and uh, then immediately punishing him at the most opportune times. But Snappy Gaps there, though. Yeah. Two way gaps there working out. Rahir stood. Rahir shielded Daz. Snappy's in position. Really good DP again. You know, it's good. Oh, oh my god, no. why did he get hit by that? It's a, it, it's a weird little crossing situation. I don't think the proxy card actually dropped in right there. Just, uh, Interesting VO set up. Doesn't get a ton off of it. Oh, oh, oh no, it yeah, He could have yeah. gotten murdered for that. He could have gotten murdered for that, but now he's in position. Cycle, 100 meter. Just use it. You have 25 back. You have your buffs. Over it. Oh, it went. Yeah, but still safe with the chain shift right there. So now gets the catch out. Rick here with this big confirm and should tie it up. Huge, huge. He's got more meter. Yeah. He's Wagner. <laughs> Wagner's pretty nasty. Do something good and go get your buffs. Yeah. Oh my god, he got hit by the plus frame move that takes 20 frames or so. It's unblockable unless you're ready for it. So, you know, uh, Rick here going to be able to get the full plus frame set up, get the flower, be able to set up just amazing strike throw, trying to make Snap guess too much about what's going on. And right now, going to be Rick here sitting in Slush Shield. Oh my god, it's so scary. Snappy's. Oh god, no, he got hit. Oh no, he got hit. It's a lot of damage. It's not. It's not a kill. It's not. No, but, but it's. Oh. It's not a kill. Oh, thank, oh, thank goodness. Yeah. Neither didn't gain enough to go to the IW variant. So, with Gears, will need one more hit just like that. What's the, the chain hit. shift? Going to be he taking it 2 1. Going to be then having to fight Clear Lamp to go make it into the top eight. Landreki well, is pretty good. Allegedly. Landreki well, is pretty good. Allegedly. You know? I saw some, like, Oki setups. I saw some, like, ice, some funny Rekkas. He has some, like, good buttons. Yeah, yeah. He has a two button DP. It's, yeah, but it's like, you know, it's, yeah, it's it loses yeah. the throws. It have does you, lose to throw. Have you tried just being correct? Have you tried just guessing correctly on all the That's options? That's all I do when I play this game. <laughs> That's all I do. Hmm. Yet you're not in the top 48. Curious. I'm not. There's another There's another <laughs> Gordo player from NorCal that did DQ out, though. Yeah, that is true. That is true. They also <laughs> won Koehime, you know? <laughs> not Crazy you, how that not, happens. Not you, unimaginably bad entrant. Uh, it might be me. It might be me. <laughs> Speaking of names that you should not say out loud, we have that one Eltonum player from SoCal versus Prem. Yep. Yep. We're going to read out the tag. It's F6ZQYGETI2YQLRU3 and Prem. And Prem, yes. Prem? Good old, good old, good old. Uh, I'm not even. <laughs> yeah, don't. You know, we read it out one time. Eltonham player SoCal yeah. versus Eltonham player NorCal. Prem's going to, I don't know. Look, uh, okay, Snappy okay. was supposed to win. I Snappy didn't win. So now I will I will say this, and I've said it on public record before, and I'll mm -hmm. say it on public record here. I think Prem is the only Eltonham player who plays Eltonham as Komode intended. Yeah, I think the book got rewritten yes. by Prem. Yes. And he's like this horrible false prophet spreading propaganda and evil. And the other Eltonhams won't listen. They'll no. just be like, no, this character's bad, man. This character's not that good. And you see Prem doing unethical things in the air, and you're just like... I don't believe it. Yeah. Do not watch. Avert your eyes. But this is, you gotta see, you gotta see the old versus the new on sort of how that Eldum mm -hmm. game plan and a lot of that thought process on there. So we'll really have to see where, like, you know, does that divide actually 
create a difference in the mirror match. Because Prem doesn't, does. Does. Prem doesn't does. play, play the mirror match a lot. Like, who's, who's another Elton Whoa, player? whoa, 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 whoa. You're forgetting about the other old head NorCal Elton player, Tensei, also in top 48. Oh, Tensei made top 48? Tensei made top 48. Okay, let's go. Never mind. Okay, okay. And if there's one person that's an old head Elton player, it's Tensei. And Prem, he grew up, <laughs> surpassed the winner's side versus yep. the loser's side. I think he's got this. I don't think Grant is ready for no. the spirit that is Prem. I don't. I don't think. I don't think they're ready for. Not only this is unchained Prem. He's had drinks. The glasses are off. Mm -hmm. He watched Tenay lose in Guilty Gear he Strive. He slept. He slept. You know, did it he hasn't been nine hours before a bracket. Did he have a meal? Probably. He's unstoppable. There's a lot to see right now. Get into the early stages of this match. Just face to face pressure right now. Oh, he just got hit by a low. It's okay. Prem's in red. Grant is in purple. Defaults. And you know, it's a good combo. See the reload? That was a bad reload. That was, that was really late that into was it. Late. That's get, not great. You, you, you get punished for that back in the old days, but you're not getting punished right now so you're able to keep the corner, but you'll probably a punish right there and get a nice yeah, side Don't swap. drop your combos. Don't drop your BNBs. You're at the cycle. You had the whole world. Prem, also a bad reload. You know, maybe it's V-Sync. Maybe it's that. Okay, the drops aren't V-Sync, though. <laughs> That's for sure. Uh, Grant's uh, maybe going to kill. Uh, no, this this, no, won't, this won't kill you. She's gonna be a lot of damage. Get a good knockdown and keep that corner pressure. Get another solid reload. But oh, good Prem, shots, good yeah. gunshots. Yeah, Prem just willing to commit to that gunshot, seeing how aggressive that they've been at those full stages right there. But the six six C gonna connect. Yeah, that's the button. That's the button. This version. It's assault. It's a mid. It does it all. It's so good. It's it, it's a little wild. All right, we're seeing some little footsies, some gunshots around. Prem didn't do anything funny after dash B. Interesting. There's something funny after dash B. Yeah, and I do like I do like uh, like really delaying that dive kick right there. Just wait to see like okay, is Grant gonna actually punish something? Or are they gonna try to capitalize on this? But Grant's already willing to play very very calm and wait for more situations like this where they can just get consistent knockdowns and consistent damage in the corner. Yeah, spend spend the hundred. You were in transfer state. You get a minor refund. Taxes came back and you get the cycle. All oh, trade. That trade fit in their favor. Oh my goodness. Crazy how that happens. Great round for SoCal Oldham right now. Yeah. 25 meter back, tax returned. Oh, not. Oh, no. Prem wasn't ready for the jank. Prem was, re he was ready to block the real, honest, good mix up, not ready for the funny one. Yeah, and I think that's like uh, that's very indicative about grand plays, right? They they want to go for the less real stuff because I think everybody's more prepared for the real things. They're waiting to see that specifically, and when you see do something that is akin to it, right? You like if you're not someone who's deep into the alma minds, you know, okay, I think everything's gonna look exactly like like this. You can get oh. some advantage out of it. Oh, good hit, Prem. Good hits. Hit him with the two C's. I want to see him throw from Prem right now. I want to see a good reload. Okay. Oh, never mind. Frame trap. Frame trap was yeah. better. Time trap was better. Great round for yep. Prem currently. Because Grant was expecting that throw right there. So finding the opportunity to actually land those punishes is going to just continue and gain and gain advantage in this state. Oh, jump oh. around. Yeah, you're not ready. The bird in the sky. One way, the other way. Regains the corner. It's, it, it's an easy kill. Yep. He did it. <laughs> I, <laughs> want, I needed to wait. He found the route. I needed he to wait. He found it. He got a perfect. That's a good way to start. Meters even. You know, that's not a great way to use your meter. That's a much better way. I think it's it's a very like it's understandable in a lot of matches that you want to be doing that because you end up being pretty safe. But Eldam is a character that can deal with Eldam very very well. Yeah. So it's gonna be a little bit harder right now. Good shields on Prem's end, just trying to stay out of the pressure. But oh, jumps back. Yeah. And not able to get all the way up, but keeps his turn. Nice, J A. J A. Dive kick, big old starter. Yeah, yeah. It works good. It hits rising. You can double jump after it. 3K, you're in the corner. You have purple bullets. And like knowing actually how to anti like air to air in this matchup and specifically is super super important because you are tending to want to like both be in the air in a lot of those situations. It's very non-traditional undernight that you get to see when you know, this mirror match happens. Oh, Prem going for the funny grab. Watch out, Grant. You have Celestial, but you know. Uh, you know, actually no, Grant doesn't need to watch out. He can get a hit. Oh, but right now they're gonna get hit, Prem. Just keeping this damage going for We'll lose the cycle as well. Just, you know, it's yeah, but the celestial it. drains down, you know, you're not getting a boatload of meter. You still get a lot, but you know. Celestial gone now, just a standard or bolt. Oh, the whiff punish. That was pretty nice. That's pretty nice, you know? Two C. Oh, oh no. no, it was awful, but he still got hit. I'm still got hit by that. 
it was kind of a checkmate, though. You know, if Prem tried to, like, EXDP, Grant had to cycle, could have CS and reacted. Yeah. He just got hit by the second hit of a low. He plays this character. He knows not to get hit by that. It's a good start for Grant. Yeah, but sometimes you have to go past the layer of knowing what to do and what not to do. You have to find those opportunities to, like, take advantage. Especially when you're behind. It's a good falling JA to try to keep the pressure going. Side oh, pull-ups not working out just yet. Nice cutting sync. We haven't seen enough of that. We got to see more of that. Spend your meter. Use the messed up EX reversal that combos and does 2.4. Oh, nice. yeah. Nice, nice, nice. Celestial. What you going to do? Are they going to tech us oh, right now? Oh, no, he mashed. He fuzzy mashed. He's so nice. Yeah. He's I, so nice. That's just a good recognition of the situation, knowing how Prem's going to want to be piloting. Going to be able to knock him down, and after the cycle, it rotates out in a couple seconds, you're going to see uh, Celestial be gone. It's less damage available on deck, but that grid is still Cutting available right here. Cutting sink. The move. He's at 200 meters. It's not enough. Go. Oh, oh, so close, so yeah. close. Tried to tech chase right there, but it's not going to work out. Grant finds a big opportunity, has IW on deck. He should be able to close that up again. No, it's OP gunshot. No. Never try to contest Elton JC. Yeah. Elton JC is too good. It's, un it's, it's unbeatable. It, it's the button of all time. It's it's one of them. I don't know if it's the button, but it's definitely one of the buttons. In terms of assault, I think it's the button. Better than, like, like Wagner JC? Better yeah. Than Really? Okay. I think Elton JC then. is like the best assault button. That's not like some obviously broken thing. Okay. It just beat a gun. Yeah, but the gun's a strike. It's not a, it, you know. It beat a gun. Yeah. That's crazy. A lot of things beat guns in this game. That's crazy. She like did a tactical flip over a bullet and, and Prem died. And Wait, now he's you see side. the Matrix, right? Come on, you should, you should be prepared I don't for know this. if the Matrix should be in Uni. I think that's like... Well, the Matrix is everywhere. I don't want Elton to be the one. <laughs> that's El El crazy. <laughs> Elton may not be the one, but at least Grant was the one who won. Yeah, SoCal. Good job to SoCal. Good job to SoCal. Yeah. But next up, we got some we have P and w. The, we have the PNW team kill happening here. We got Poppy Seed versus Clem. Uh, Poppy Seed is Casey. Uh, they're entering under a different tag for this tournament. For Fun thing to do. Yeah. Fun thing to do, Wait, you know? Uni, uni players with weird tag names? It's never happened. Never happened before. Never happened. Never happened at all. Uh, but, yeah, yeah this, is a, this is a, like, a matchup that happens so much at our larger events when... Uh, when DC everyone comes come out. Down. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Uh, and I think Clint's going to be still sticking with Merkava. I don't see the phone on pick coming out. I think he's been very happy with Merkava in this version of the game. Good character. Good yeah. character. He's got that funny 2FF. He Pretty flies solid. around. He sets up the worm guys. And, you know, it, it, Merkava's always been solid. And now 2FF makes, like, you know, Clint's a salary man. He doesn't lab stuff he, or a no. lot. He doesn't go into training no. a lot. Give me my setup. Go, so go. He, you have one button set up into the, the hard thing that you were doing before. It's good. It's, it's perfect for somebody like Clint. Casey, yeah. on the other hand, lab feed, someone who's always trying to find these new mix-up opportunities, being that Hilda player, and I'm pretty sure they're going to lock into Hilda, right? They, they, they do Hilda's have a Laudrakia. That is someone that they were playing at the end of player, and they've been playing more and more. And I was talking with them, and like, they're like, I'm thinking about it, but I'm probably locking into Hilda. More importantly, they have a Gordo. I think Gordo and Merkava, that's a solid matchup. Yeah, that's a solid matchup. One of, like, it's not a ton. But there's a Merkava's one of them. He has some really good spacing options against that. He'll look, you know, fine as well. He'll do a really good character. Yeah. You got actual mix. Yeah, now with Roomba being able to create some oh, insane man. new mix opportunity. Roomba the 13th. What an addition but to the game. Roomba is actually, like, not as good versus Merkava because a lot of the Roomba setups, you usually have to, like, block string into them. Mm. Like, after setting it, you don't get the guaranteed Roomba unless you're in the corner. And we saw in their match versus Smiles on stream where Smiles is just like, okay, back tech out. Air Assault over, get away, or even that we saw like the delay tech and the rumor just goes under, yeah. not proking. I think you just stay in the skies and go far away, and that's exactly where Merkava wants to be. So it can be a little bit hard to you know get that full rumor to go. We'll have to see what Poppy Seed can do right here, or if Clem can shut him down. Oh, right over, right over. Using your funny, funny overhead, you just in your. Oh man, Clem's gaming. Well, that's a good shield and punish, though. Yeah. Really solid. And another very important thing with this Poppy Seed plays against Oz. Very, 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 very able, sorry. And they are one, like another very solid Merc player, going to be able to deal with a lot of this uh, basic pressure. It's going to be up to Clem to find these new opportunities. Right now, Poppy Seed not having it. 
You know, Rimba came out. You know, you were pretty plus. That was not plus frames anymore. That was just some solid timings. Poppy Seed taking this round pretty cleanly. Oh, oh no. Okay, okay. Yeah. Pretty cleanly. Yeah, I, I don't you know. Sit there to get counter hit oh, at the very moderately end, cleanly. Yeah. Moderately cleanly. Oh, shield doesn't matter, though. You can still cancel that. It's a little cheating. Yeah. And, you know, every so often the character cheats, you know? Hilda will put out a Roomba. Mercava will put out some worms. Everybody, you have to cheat in this game to be able to win, right? Like, yeah. like every character is doing something a little messed up and a little dangerous. And right now, Klim has seen that dangerous. Worm sets back at it again. Going to go for a little bit more mix the and green. find the green shield. Extra damage from the baby's biting. Yeah. Nice VO. Yeah. Yeah. Using the one reversal option that Hilda has. Sets up for the, the ground spike instead of a Roomba right uh, there. said, flies over it. Yeah. Roomba's not active, doesn't do anything. Shusso and a whiff punish there is actually really nice. You're still getting some bonus damage, and you got all your meter. Pretty good. Extra 500 damage, 200 meters. That's enough to win this round, maybe. Okay, great shield on that flight. Not going to give them any cancel options. And just allow them oh, to stay the safe. the Roomba was set up perfectly, yeah. but the confirm. And it gets another one. You're going to have to hold this in the corner, whatever. Oh, Come back. It's right behind him. It's right behind him. Oh, my God. Amazing. Amazing. Yeah. He's so skilled. Not lucky. Skilled that the Roomba was just barely out of range. Yeah. Then takes that round survives. B being able to find themselves at that right space. And, you know, it, it, it's, it's creating that luck. It's creating those opportunities to put them in situations of success. So even if they're not prepared for it. Look for the charge to have ever right there. We get a little bit of a better flight. Now you're seeing Casey just have to hold on to pressure. Did build Celestial, but Clem going to hit him out and say, I don't really care. You know, dispensing grid is part of the game. That was a lot of moves. There's like, oh, this is a really good move. It costs grid. It gives them some of that. But, you know, let's see. Casey needs to be winning with the meter. And and we saw a good hit right there, but unfortunately couldn't find the full finish. And a nice use of the 6C right there, going to get out of that overhead attempt. Yeah, we saw it happen in the start of the round. We see it happen again. Yeah. Now we're getting the worms. All right, does CS trying to space out, trying to run away. Oh, oh it's helper. Same side. Yeah. Really interesting option. Yeah, just really mixing them up. There's a lot of people just trying to teleport out. Clip is already trying to be prepared for that, but obviously now he gets to stay safe back in the mid-screen. Find another counter hit, but Fett can't find the 2-2-X, two -two so we'll find a 5-CC instead. You know, you get in your hits, you drop one, a little nook to drop there. Oh, that's really nice, though. Yeah. No CS, though, you can't get an extra confirm. BO, yeah, that's your defensive option. You got to use it. Oh, yeah, nice. fast skewer. Fast yeah. skewer, you got tagged. Just do your thing. It's going to be plus anyways. Yeah. You got meters to spend. The room is coming on the way. And we saw Clib always want to be really aggressive from that side of the screen. Right? Never playing patient, always being like, okay, I'm going to I'm gonna arm. I'm going to jump. I'm going to fly. I'm going to do something to try to just uh, get back into distance. it. Get back and, into those ranges. It was really smart on Poppy's inside to just pressure them down right at the last moment of the round. But now Clib's going to be thinking about it. So you're going to have to change it up. You're going to figure out new things to do at that full screen range. Yeah. So a little arm come out. We're jumping past each other now. Clim barely eking out the cycle and the shield on the 5C. 2-2X missing right there, so it's going to be Clint getting a free knockdown we'll and a great see. roll to get out of the corner situation. Even if you have to hold this, you're not getting put all the way into the corner. And you got the cycle. You know, roll takes a little bit of grid left. Yeah. Or oh, dive kick. Watch out. Yeah, spaced out of the disjoint on the 6 b right, or 6 c right there. 6 b would have been able to connect it, but Klim going to connect the last bit of that 6 2 3 c You spent meter, you're down 100. You got a round to play with. You're yeah. fine. You'll build some more. Oh, away and I love from that. The Roomba. Stay away. Yeah. Stay away, little car. But Roomba going to be coming back shortly, so Klim does have to be a little careful. That's that still pressure. going. Okay. I think it's gone. Oh, I think it's okay. gone. But, you know, Casey, you got the cycle. Still has 100 meter. There it goes. There's the friend. And now finds the hit. And find, can you see even finding these little stray hits? Forcing Clem to stay down in this situation. Ruma, they're not going to come over, so has to just go for some classic uh, mix. Still there. It's gone. Okay. Yeah. Oof, scary. Scary that that 100 meter option was just out on the screen the whole time. Getting tagged by that. I don't know the exact frame that on Ruma cancel, but you know, worked out for Casey there. Yeah. And now they're going to get stuck on it. One more good knockdown. It's just back out of the group because they were waiting for that. Clem had been going for the option so much to try to get out of all these situations. This time we're changing it up. We're hitting with the 5C instead. Tag every part of the screen. And they tried to go for it again, but this time Clem already adapted into the 2 and 4 a oh, Nice shield. Doesn't trust the frame data, though. Nice pickup. Really close to the air hit. But Makala still able to pick this up. Not the biggest, but you know. Oh. 
Nice anti-air, not a big pickup. Oh, okay, do we have those? Back We're throw just going punish. for throw. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, it's a back throw, you get the corner, you're chilling with that. Yeah, you just have a 100 meter index if you would like it. Normally, the hell would like to try to get into a 50 50 situation, but on this kind of tournament stage, you know, you never want to take those big risks. You're just scared making it Oh, man, Vio actually tagging something. Clem was in the air in that hit. Yeah. Oh, man. And gets the full pickup off this as well with a good knockdown up from the 580 Ender. Good shields on there, just trying to make sure they can always get the cycle, but they can't have an FF connect. Death. Clem takes a second game. Yeah. Fine with those. Nice little 5 be over there, just reaching all the way. Grab came out. If that didn't kill, you had a lot more time to kill. That would have been a combo afterwards. Yep. Yep. New change. Did he need it? Who knows? We'll find out in six months. Who knows? We'll find out at, at, a, at a later time. Now, Casey, really just, I like, I love this. Just sit and think. I'm a big think proponent of, yeah. of ice your opponent out every single chance you can get. Yeah. Especially a player like Klim, who is, tends to be pretty momentum driven because they're a little bit more reliant on the fundamentals than the, like, raw core systems of Uni. Uh, obviously, they've been playing a lot more with the release of Uni, too, but it's always just good ice your opponent out. Yeah. Oh, my God. Klim's getting, like, such nice hits. We saw Casey avoid some of them less than that last game, but Klim still won that one out, but start of this round, we saw like two pretty strong hits. Not the biggest combos, but you know. But it got Casey all the way to the corner, and that's a very good situation for you to be. I love that CS. Give Casey a chance, but unfortunately, that's not going to connect. And you see Casey nodding here. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. Not being able to get that blocked is really scary. The worm oh, no! is here. Come in from downtown, oh. hit from behind right there. Man, they hit, they're hitting so high from behind. It was going to be such a good situation for Kate. Oh, my goodness. Went for an aggressive worm right there. Now, Casey, you got to get full reward for it. Oh, my God. If that was EX, Casey would have died. Oh, oh, you can't EX. Yeah, you actually had to go for just a normal grab confirm. Just three, five A's. That's pretty good. Yeah, I mean, Casey had to take a gamble right there, right? They were looking for, like, okay, there's no red flash. What are they going to do in this post CS situation? Clint just stayed really, really calm with a really good 5A. Now Casey's going to stay calm with that 5CC. Yeah, you can't just try to hop over the button every time. That was really far away. Casey was able to get the easiest whiff punish. Send out the bam. Yeah, I know you see Falls right into it. Yeah, no pressure. Who cares? No, but 6 c didn't connect with that skewer will, but that 6 c will, it's completely spaced out by just a couple pixels, and now Grid broke him. The The amnesia. No, it's not amnesia, it's hypnosis. Yeah, yeah. The air hypnosis. You want to air shield so badly? Oh, babies are attacking. Extra damage, 2.4. Yeah, fighting the back damage control. Vio's out of perfect time once again. Skewer out. He uses that 2-2x at a perfect time. He's going to be able to lock down with the glue. But 2 3 6 going to connect. And we keep it simple with that combo. Klim yeah. takes it 2-1. Good stuff to Klim. You know, you used your good-ass option. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's DP. I'm getting out of here. I'm getting a combo. Well, it's a tool that Clinton uses very, like, seldom, right? They don't yep. want to always be pressing it. Because if you're someone who's a little aggressive on pressing, the 2 3 6 people are just going to be banging it out constantly. But yeah. Clem, good stuff. Also... Good stuff for our sponsors here yes. at Flashback 2024. Yes, thank you to all of our wonderful sponsors who are here supporting the event. Make sure to check all of it out, especially this merchandise, which is so sick. I love all the Slashback merch that we have right here. It's available now, but some of it's only available for a limited time, so you should check it out. It's the best way to support this event. April 2020, April 22nd is going to be your cutoff. Yep. Slashback.info slash shop or that QR code in your top right. Who knows when things are going to go away or change, though? You yeah. know, things have been... Those Bochi... Uh, Bochi Moch? It's been changing yeah, mysteriously. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Who knows when it changes? You, you'll have to know by constantly keeping up to date with it as well. You should keep up to date with 10.0 Media's end of season sale. Yeah, things that are going away as well. These shirts? Yes. Who yeah. knows which ones are coming back? Yeah. Who knows what the stock is right now? Well, you'll so go now. You'll never know unless you go check. There's 30% off happening right now, so make sure to check that out at merch.10-o.gg. QR codes in the bottom right this time. You know, saw some top right, saw some bottom right. Shout out to QR codes. Shout out to QR really codes. Easy. And shout out to Blazing Strike, published by Axis. Classic modern fighting game or modern classic? Uh, it, it's, a, it's a modern classic and a classically modern game featuring stuff from these newer modern titles as well as these old 90s retro titles, such as like Perry's. We all love Perry's. Love Shout Perry's. out to Akatsuki. But yeah, make sure to check out Blazing Strike. Going to be ha uh, having rollback net code and it should be out, I think, either, I think it's sometime this year or early next year, something like it's that. Soon. Check them it's out. Soon. They got social media and stuff. Catch it on consoles and all that. Yep, yep, yep. Well, you should also check out the World Serpent Championship, the global Blaze Blue Central Fiction Online Major. Play Blaze Blue online, worldwide. Yep. Fight for your country. 
fight for everything. Not, no. with, not only your country, your continent, because this, this goes over it's five continents. continents? There's, oh my it is goodness. five continents. You know, a lot of people say for global, it's like, oh, U.S., Western Europe, East Asia. But this is everywhere. Yeah, There's it's everywhere. It's everywhere. If you're interested in playing Blaze Blue, tournaments are starting from April to May. Look at that start.gg link. Yeah. WSC 2024. Check out their bis their Discord. Yeah. Bit.ly slash WSC Discord. You can catch all the action. See more Blaze Blue. You should always play more Blaze Blue. Play more Blaze Blue. But also play more Uni, just like Knots and Bayside like Mill Hunter. Hunter. I, lo be I love I love the other thing. Oh yeah. It's so it's good. pretty good. It's so good. Just like these two players are also very, very good at their game, you know. Uh not the world champion the right world, now. The world champion, you know, did switch uh, contrary to everyone else, I feel like, switched off of Wagner. Right? No, a lot Seth's of nasty. A lot of people were like, oh, Wagner's pretty strong, six uh, six FF, and as well as just the general system changes, put her in a very good position. But Randy was like, no, nah, I'm gonna start playing Seth. Yeah, started in late clear. Yep. Not early clear, pretty late. 2023 was about the start of it. About. You saw it a little bit at Combo Breaker, I think you saw it at uh, Evo. Fro Frosty Faustings was with the first tournament he brought it interesting. up. Interesting. He brought it out and then like for the last game then like lost. So Yeah, that happens. But yeah, he he's evolved past just button Seth. Yep. And or just do stuff, Seth. He's doing a bit of both. I remember at Evo, he was he was a little bit of both and a little pretty mid at both. And now, that guy's fast. He runs up in your face. He's doing five A. That's strike throw. And it's it's a, a very strike throw like that. And when you gave the Wagner player the fast strike throw character with the real mix up options, it can be a very very scary situation. So let's see how BM can handle it. Oh yeah. Oh five CC the button. It's his thing. He hits it, he's just going forward, he's hitting twice. You see a nice little combo. Orbs holding it down, oh, nice anti-air. Yeah, yeah. I love that you, just, you have the orb send out with the 2A check, forcing them to go for like a 177 or having to hold a really whack mix up. And then just guaranteeing yourself an anti-air, guaranteeing yourself this corner position again and again and again. Yeah, what are you gonna do? Seth's just on you? No CS on that. No. Like it's tag mine, I saw 2A. BM actually able to make it out. Gets a nice side swap. Knots in the corner. Webs are active. Three. Watch out. Oh, oh, yeah. And that roll is really good because of, like it takes you away from the screen temporarily, so just resetting you right in front of them is very, very safe. So I'm not screw that air, the anti-air shield. A little scary. Didn't actually connect. Could have gotten blown up for it. But look at that dash. Look at them. It's the quick. acceleration. Yeah, and that's what you need to. You have to find a great jump right there, accelerating them even more forward into the M's pressure, but that 5A got to connect right at the tip. Oh, yeah, that's one of the buttons. You have, Biafé got some stop signs. That is, a five, Biafé is definitely one of the buttons. Oh, yeah. 5A, 5B is like, no, stop. It's a it's a red octagon. You must hold my neutral. Oh, oh. Actually, he stood up into the web. Nas dies yeah. in his first round. Was, like, waiting on that throw attempt right there, just seeing BM play very, very cautious, and then getting blown up by the web that was still there, not being able to block it out right there. And this is a big change that 5A dealt with him on Crouchers with this version. It's a good stuff. It's good stuff. Oh, dash forward. Oh, he's so scary. That interaction just comes right at you. Assault hitting. Not the biggest combo. Nice anti-air kick from below. Yeah, getting the fast fall follow-up right there is like a, is a huge confirm charge scaling-wise, but also going to lead you into some great knockdowns as long as you have meter. But BM willing to just press in that situation. What are you doing? You weren't meeting. That throws in fast enough. Come on, you gotta... You gotta have some standards of, oh wow, might be catching the back blink. That was really far. It was really, really far. I mean, BM has just been very confident in their presses, and I think that's the big thing, right? Like showing, hey, I don't have to worry about it. Already has the three webs set with the one on the ground, just gonna have to hold this. Now strike throw, coming up. Oh, Knotts gets rid of the top web, gets thrown into the web and dies. <gasps> no! Okay, okay, it's, it's fine, fine, it's fine, it's fine. No excitement, because that, yeah, was, that, yeah, was, yeah, that, was, that yeah, was a that was a reset. He should have had that. It was a drop opportunity. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. You know, Randy is like, yeah, you know, you can have it. You yeah, can have yeah, it. Yeah, I yeah, deserve yeah, to lose yeah. that round. This round, you'll try a little bit harder. The funny jump back, set the orb. What are you gonna do about chaos? Just jumping back like that? That's not chaos. It's like, oh my god, <laughs> this one. Well, I'm the match is chaos right now with how hectic these players are, constantly moving all over the screen, oh, pressing at these very, very confident times. Great three C anti air. Knots falling right into the spider's den here. Oh yeah, knots in the air. BM closer that time. You know, full screen up back, pretty good. That range a little scary. Oh yellow throw, not a TRM command grab. Why does he have that? He Who needs knows? It. He needs it. Gets it down one more time. Gonna be just kind of like so, so cautious here. 
BM though just willing to take the throw again and again and again on those situations. Dive kick connecting here. The combo doesn't though. It's so sad. Orbs holding down. Oh, the frame chop. His Tiger's got a little bit better. Yeah, a little bit better. This and now version. utilizing the new force function that's available for Seth, creating these better combo opportunities to just guarantee that round kill right there. Excellent stuff from Knox. Doesn't even need the meter. Start at 200. Oh, nice 2C hit. Not a nice confirm. This one will be a good confirm. This is going great. You know, you got 200. You're going to spend some. You're going to get an orb. Spends 100. Orb out. No, uh, orb a little late. Yeah. Really nice. Yeah, the delay orb right there gave BM just a huge opportunity to get the run up and then be able to start challenging. And BM, when BM is able to challenge, they have been so right again and again and again. But now not finding some great Abare. Oh, man. It's such a sad job. You know, you're going to get your web set up. You're going to get Oki. Okay, drop back. You know, things are even. Yeah, things are even. Two, oh, two, two EX. Watch out. I love like, I love the players are finally getting that last blue shield attack on the two TC gonna be able to keep themselves a little bit safer the Bianc does try to do something a little risky after it. Yeah. But now BM just keeps it very classy, keeps it calm, holding them oh. there, tries to see grab, but it's not gonna work out. Oh man. That's so sad. You're dead, Knots. You're dead. Yeah. It's all your meter charge. Good job. Good job. You know. Set point BM. Yeah. Scary. Doing Knots the work is right the now. world champion. Well, let's see if the new world champion, see if that belt can be passed down here. It is WrestleMania weekend. Those belts are transferring around. Oh, yeah. Anats holds the second place belt from last year as well. This is a scary situation to be in. See right now, good nice tech's tech. out. And it's in, uh, tech in the advantage of Knots, so being able to still keep that pressure going is so Scary green good. shield. DX, get your tons of grid. Nice hit there. Bjork whiffing finally. Celestial damage. I want to see 200. I want to see you spend that 200. Do it. Yeah. yeah. Goes the IW. No need for 5 AB right Look here. Look at that number. 5.4. Yeah, Seth can Man grab a CS in orb. Oh, oh my god, no. no. Oh my yeah. god, no. We just aud audible for second orb again. Didn't want to try to get any extra damage because you just need to get a guaranteed kill right here. Oh can get hit no. on 6-3B. Oh my god, no. Did you see getting shielded orb set right there oh, on the mid side? Up. Who knows where he's going? He's funny. He's blinking around. Kick upwards. Yeah. Crossing Nuts. those ankles up, that shutting them down. That was really scary. You know, Knott's had like all of his life. Yeah. And I was still terrified from those two drops. I was like, you shouldn't be dropping. Well, those. it's also Seth as a character, like you see, oh, they have a ton of life, but they are being that pixie character, having that lower health in this now killing game. In this of game TV. where like average health characters can take half health combos yeah. once in a while. Very scary for the fairy of the game. Yeah. So let's see right now who can come out on top. The Pixie Ghost Spider right here. Stay off here. Got the cycle orb, anti air missile defense system. Yeah. Works out really well, you know. Yacht still the cycle, uses it. Nice throw punish, actually. Yeah. And he just goes uh, getting the guaranteed web set, but still a little too early. So Knott's now finding that gold tech and fighting a 63B with a big counter hit as oh. BM tried to be a little aggressive there. And now, you know, you spent your cycle. You're going to start gaining more once this combo ends. You know, BM had the cycle for a bit there, got like a hit, but this is significantly more impactful. Yeah. Oh, gets a little greedy after the shield. You know, you got the cycle. You maybe had a little bit better frame advantage, but now you're dead alive. Oh, yeah, you you have one touch away, and once again, we'd say these are these comeback situations are super super common. Oh, JAJB, find it. Do another JAJB. Oh, just JP assault, yeah. so good. That's one of those. But those buttons, Hyde's got one of those buttons. Seth's got one of those buttons. Yeah. They're nasty. They're nasty. Th those kinds of like JBs and those air normals are so good for these like aggressive striker characters, especially for characters like Yacht, who have a little bit of a harder time dealing with those anti airs with their quick buttons. Oh yeah, but now, very clean shield, leading to a nice combo, spends 100, has the cycle. Well, oh, funny force function. All right, we're hanging. Oh man, 2C tag, no confirm. Yeah, we're just staggering up. Seth's got buttons. Yeah. Watch out. You have to use those staggers to get plenty of opportunities. Those, your grabs and your mix don't work forever. Now, BM had a great back dash right there. Going to give them the turn and now give them the hit. Yeah, after the back dash, going for the freebie. A little scary there. Oh, oh man, Assault yeah. JB again. So nice. So nice. You have the cycle. You're going to have 200 meter. I'm not going to say it. I don't think it is. I don't think uh, it is. You, I think with the 5 AB oh. re re uh, scaling right uh, there, you are. Oh, my yeah. God. Yeah, yeah, the 5AB, like... Oh, my God. 
reset? I, I don't remember 100. I think it's like like semi resets the scaling. It reduces some of it on the knockdown to get additional damage. I swear, because there's combos that I'll do that will I will do. Just, just getting like a thing that goes in IW that doesn't cost a bounce was like, oh man, that's really good. Yeah, it's really really good. Uh, it's if it really does good. more scale, oh man. Um, I can't believe he died. Yeah, I I can because I saw it on the screen. You I did saw see that on breakdown. Screen, yeah. We saw what happened there. We saw the past. We wouldn't have believed it. <laughs> but the past future is now. The future is now. And the future is not advancing. Staying yeah. alive in Winterside, trying to hold down, maybe perform better than last year. Yeah, we'll have to see, you know, trying to get that first place crown. But this bracket is even tougher than last year. Last year was a very, very hard bracket to be able to try to get all yeah. the way through. Clear lamps here. Yeah. Clear but lamps here. And you know who else is here? Rurik and Kai Ai, right. a mysterious yeah. player who knows who he is. Yeah, I'd never seen Maybe from before. New York. Potentially named Brandon. Potentially. You know. Definitely a Linnae player. Or, mm, could be. Don't tell me he's not a Linnae player. I'm, ass I'm, ass I'm assuming he's still on Linnae. I don't think he's. I'd be so crazy. If he's on Londrekia, I'm going to be like so mad. I'm going to yell at him. <laughs> I'm going to yell at him. Go back to your roots. <laughs> Go back to your roots. He said that uh -huh. NorCal doesn't have footsies. If he's not on Linnae, he doesn't have loyalty. <laughs> and that's way worse. I'm looking at the stage. I want to see. He's, he's just yeah, he's, he's got a hip box. He's delaying it. You know, he's, he's got the Fumo. He's got, I think he, he has Valorant open again. <sighs> he would have Valorant open. It's, uh, know, it's you like just have to, group you know, that's hip box. You know, hip box is Valorant. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, you don't have to, like, actually know your lineups. <laughs> you don't have to know your inputs. You just, like, click on the map. Like, you know what? I want my smoke grenade right here. Counter Strike, you gotta know right where you gotta have your cursor to hit window on Mirage. You, you gotta know. You want that? You want that tool? You gotta know. You gotta know. You have to know. You, you wanna DP something? You, you gotta you, input you, it. You need the pixel perfect lineups. Oh yeah. You wanna fuzzy jump? No, none of this. None of these no, SOCDs. Those are just hero oh, abilities. Yeah. That's just actually, cheating. It's cheating. It's, actually, cheating. it's I'm gonna hero but It's an yeah. ultimate. It's an ultimate. <laughs> it's an ultimate. You know. You want a fuzzy mash of <laughs> SOCD? You're you're ulting right there. You know. <laughs> what one seven one on the hitbox is the razel of, of fighting games. Yeah, it really is. <laughs> it really is. Oh. oh, man, you know, I had some great lore about Brandon's shirt. Oh, yeah? It's from Japan. Yeah. A great music festival, Countdown Japan. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah it's, a, it's an Ella Garden shirt. Banger band. B banger. Shout out to Ella Garden. Shout out to Ella Garden. Please uh, go play Slash well, Please five. do a button check so I can. Okay, there are a bunch of people watching. Yeah. Uh, this shirt, it's their oversized shirt. Yeah. It's pretty tight. Unfortunately, uh, they ran out of XLs when our person in the merch line, yeah. Brett, the GOAT tournament organizer, they just, I, they just ran out of XLs. And I'm too large, so I just couldn't get that shirt. Yeah. And and then I read that's like, oh, yeah, I got another large for Brandon. I'm like, that guy. That guy from New York got one of these shirts. You didn't? I didn't. And it's such a good shirt. But Rurik's shirt, I like it. And rurik has got a very solid shirt. Rur Rurik's got the salary man shirt. Yeah. This is what he, he wears that to work, I guarantee you Absolutely. Yeah, Absolutely. Yeah, yeah. I wear it to work. It's nice. Yeah, it's clean. It's clean. Uh, but yeah, Rurik, you know, uh, being the, the most prominent Yuzu, I think, since yeah. the, the Claire days, right? Yeah. Uh, showing success and bringing it down here. But I believe, if I remember, is this still Winterside? This is Winterside. This is Winterside. Okay, Kai yeah. is in Winners. Rurik's in Winners. It should be their first match inside Winners. And right now, Yuzu, nice little star. Nice little combo. Stay away, rat character. Oh, oh throw it scary. Yeah, just slightly too far out, but Kai finding the run under air, air to air right there and then gonna be able to just guarantee this knockdown. Oh, yeah, you rolled all the way under all that. The original roll, and you have the cycle, you have the corner pressure, the least get. Oh, yeah. yeah. You try you to anti air the character in the air? Just tiss. Well, not, not only the character air, not only Yuzu, this is work, the nine holder supreme. He okay. wants to just always be out there, he's always ready to immediately go into stance, try to stay safe, and try to use EX slashes right there to cut out the EX Kuga, but Kai, uh, Kai I finds it once again. Good throw tech out. Oh, actually gets the counter after teleport. Really nice. All, I thought the back dash, the frame that might have been a little scary for Kai, but you know, still getting it. Easy punish yeah. on roll. No, no. No, no, we're at CS. You are dead. not alive. You you are definitely dead here. No need to guess like the last time. Because these IWs deal so, so stressful. Much. I've seen too many bad drops. We're keeping it nice and clean. You spent 200. You have a whole round to work with. These are two players who keep it professional. They're not they're not dropping everything. They're not you know playing loosey goosey here. They're trying to just keep it clean. Try to move forward into these rounds. Good tech out. We're gonna go for a, a scary shield. Jumping back, getting the hit, actually still losing the cycle though, surprisingly. But you know, you got a hit, you're chilling, you got a big old combo. Kai is out of the corner, back in, getting hit. 
Yeah, this is the advantage with those like using teleports right there, because you always you kind of have to make a, a guess on their teleport which one they're actually going to be going for. And we're it plays so perfectly, you don't get a chance to make. Got right back to 200 meter. A B Ender kill. Yep. Easy. P you got two. You started at zero meter. Yeah. You got to 200 meter. They were dead. That's yeah. the game. Three that's hits. the game. That's the game. And that's, Yuzu, that's that's Yuzu especially with this version because a, a lot of her EX stuff is very particular, right? EX yeah. EX lashes you're using as specific enders, so it's very comfortable for you to just sit and wait till you hit 200 meters. Smash meter. it! Smash yeah. the 200. Get your big old damage bonus. Yep, yep, yep. Get a game. Yeah. Brandon getting the eye drops in right now. Oh yeah, the Rotos. Evo yeah. Japan Classic. Shout out to Roto Man. Shout out to Roto Man. Get him at Slashback. Yeah, look here. at him. He's focused now. <laughs> he has the eyes. Yeah, those eyes are wide open now. They're oh, locked man. in. Oh, but Rurk's locked in even further now yeah. to this match. He's smoking the FF from Brandon. You know, he's getting a big old hit. 3.5. MD. Come on, it's Rurk. You know he's going to do that. Yeah, it's You the, got a fuzzy match. He does you gotta. It so much and so consistently. You can't he's hit through, that off the glaze. He's stand tech all the way up. He was all the way up there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He was like three stories up. And you're like, I'm knocking, man. You're stand tech. And I know, I know. Oh, man. But yeah, Kai is dead. I do He's respect. Done. I respect the stand tag at that point. That's that's a, that's made to his principles right there. He got to change his principles. <laughs> yeah, you know, but he got to change but schools. Get to a different school district or something. <laughs> okay. Oh, oh, counter hit off the little whiff slash. That was nice. Yeah. But we're at the cycle now. Now you just got to get like in against Yuzu. But the, honestly, a bigger thing is Rurik actually needs to find an opportunity to open them up, and that's something that Rurik, that, or that Yuzu can struggle a little bit with, right? You sometimes have to play a more aggressive strike throw game, and that puts you right into Brandon's exact range they want to be at. This is where you can see it right here. Rurik having to play a little up close. Yeah, when Yuzu and Lene are too close, Lene will just have faster things. Yep. At like, oh, he didn't oh. fuzzy. He didn't fuzzy. Come on, you're stand taking. You have 5A. Yeah. You, just, you just do it. You just do it. If you blocked, it doesn't come out. So and do if you did it, you would have gotten a combo. You'd still have the cycle. Yep. But now you're in the corner. You're, you're sad. You're, and you're holding this big counter hit as well. Rurik does drop it, though, but you're going to take the opportunity to charge the cycle. Makai finds a great shield right there. Not only are you going to punish, but to gain the cycle at the last minute. Don't get the best combo, but you got a little bit. You got meter. You got the cycle. Oh, my God. He's so close. You know, he's so close. If he just like cleaned up a little bit, he'd be winning. Oh. That's really nice. Yeah, that's, that's a good, good way to use your meter. You're in. Yeah, Rurik so does have the cycle, so if they can find a gap or they're a little bit safe like that, tries to throw, but Kai gets a great back dash. Not even try to punish it. Oh, 2 FF, so scary. Yeah, that's the dangerous part. Those slashes recover so quickly that oh, the uh, force function is not able to punish them because of a disjoint. Spam is the 100. I'm not sure I agree. I think saving the 200 there is like really important for Rurik. I feel like if you're able to just get an IW, you just win the game instantly. Oh, ah, no. Won. Oh, no. Yeah, Kai is dead. It's all right. Yeah. Spend 100 only. Don't even CVO. Kids, always CVO and hit three buttons yep. when it's a kill. You had to input that. It's, but the thing is, 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 I think it may have actually been slightly too far out. The CVO may not. The CVO. You could have done it earlier. Yeah, you could have. low life. You get IWEX sometimes. But you're in a pretty safe situation even if you drop there. Right? You have the life lead. There's four seconds left. It's and you're, consistent. You're, it's you're muscle memory. You just yeah. you jump up, teleport, like stance, and then you just wait for them to do something and teleport across the screen. He's just pretty good. Got some good routes. She's all right. Rurik, staying winners, advancing. Yeah, Kai yeah. loser side now. Who knows who he'll be fighting? Somebody. But we know Somebody. who our next two players are. We have Mario versus Tannison. Mario, slashback last year's champion. Yep. Wagner, last version. This version, Wagner, you know, I don't think Wagner got the most. She got enough. She and with, and, and with, with the systems changes to the increased damage and the faster cycle, she is in a great spot. She's in a good spot, you know? She's not in the best spot. You no, know? no, no. We had the best system change of VO Strip being gone. Yes. Well, yes, you're going to agree? I thought I saw a tweet sorry, from you. Sorry, I Yeah, say, I apologize for that Let me, let me, let me it. Yes, VO Strip being gone, good for game. Good Bad for me because I was carried by it. Thank you. Thank you. I, I like it though. I, I still like the Ostrip. I'll defend. I'll defend that I like I it. I think we could have made it universal and I, it would have been fine. I, I think it's. I, I still think it's unhealthy for the game. It's bad. But I also sometimes you know I like my junk food, right? I love. Sometimes you get in and out. Sometimes you need that in and out. Salads Can't, are better for sa your everyday life. Salads are better, but sometimes you know you want that delicious double double animal style. That's a good time. Mario liked that double double animal style. Uh, yeah, yeah. Now you <laughs> That's know. That's how he plays. He plays pretty animal style as well. <laughs> 
Sometimes, sometimes. I think Tannison, though, I don't even know if I've watched Tannison, but he's a Waldstein player. Yeah, he's also... I don't trust Waldstein players. He is... Uh, he is alternate no, I know, I, I know what he was going to do. I, saw, I read a tweet. Oh, yeah? Yeah, he said against Gordell, he's just going to hit up option every wake up. Yeah. And I'm like, yeah, yeah, yeah. how dare you? How dare you just choose to dice roll like that? you got to think a little bit. Sometimes being the one rolling the dice is super beneficial. Not like, really like not letting your opponent control your dice, control your fate right now. We're gonna see Mario's a fate again. controller for sure, though. Oh, my God. The empty second high didn't actually come out. Mario, yeah. Strike throw. Nice tech. It's a good hit. Yeah, it's a, it's a good opportunity starter for Tannison to be able to get the game plan going right now. AB, Ender, a little extra damage. You got a lot of cycle. Mario absolutely losing it. The DP single hit. The 5 AB is so important for Wall because a lot of his combos will use two wall bounces super early on. So a lot of these stray hits, now that you can find yourself with guaranteed knockdowns, even if it's at the cost of grid, is a very beneficial situation. Though. Mario, you gonna just continue to find these bigger openings right here as Tannison's trying to press. Tannison didn't even try to press. No counter. He just stood up. Stood up into 2C. Yeah. Dying. Burn away, Waldstein. Burn away. Wagner. Oh, man. Now you're getting counter hit. Clean. Yeah, clean. You know, you got Mario hit like once. It's a little scary. But, you know, clean rest of the round. But Solid strike throw. I think a big thing is going to be trying to find these big opportunities. Mario, though, ready for those 2 3 six Cs and able to find these full pickups with them as well. Mario, Street Fighter player. You're going to yeah. try to jump at him. He is ready. He has got options. Oh. That's a really late green shield. Very unfortunate for Tannis in there. Yeah, I think they were trying to input it earlier, but just, you know, was slightly delayed on it. Mario going to be cashing out for those double buffs once again. Oh, Stand empty. Empty. Oh, oh, no, no, no. Shield buff. Watch out. Throw would have been a good option, but, you know, CS was there. You know, Wagner CS shield buff. Like, what are you going to do? Yeah, you, what are you you're going to die. That's what's going to happen. Oh, yeah. You, that is an opportunity for you to just get blown up. And I love that aggressive dash right there, trying to stay in those closer ranges because you're looking for big hits like that from Tannison. Misses the throw. Maybe would have been a green shield punish. Maybe not. But, you know, oh, that's, that's a little frightening. So th this is what I was worried about. Tannison is a little bit more reserved as a Waltz team player most of the time. And Mario definitely has the, the screw it, we ball mentality. They will just rip that DP win, like, whenever they feel like it, and they get big advantage for it. But Tannison, right now, keeping control of the corner. Oh, not far enough. That moves really good, this version. It's, like, just barely minus. Slightly punishable from some things, but the range that wall ends, that's really nice. You can just let that ADP rip. Nice command grab. Yeah, yeah. You know, that, was, that was pretty good. That was standard. Yeah, it, but it's also now representing that off team. Like, they haven't got an opportunity to show that off. They would have to play a little bit more cautious. Oh, mm. nice. Don't even try it against Mario. Don't even try it, you know? Maybe we did no, he knows the difference. Yep. He knows the difference between clap. The clap is the smiles. If you're playing at the level of these kind of players, you kind of ha you have to know the difference. You right? have to know. Oh, really nice mash out after the repeat though from Tannison. You know, oh, catches back dash. Nine looking confirmed. Throws a rock. Yeah, you always have to make them remember Rock. Rock is a tool that, you know, a lot of people have forgotten about because uh, Power Geyser has kind of replaced it. I mean, yeah, I feel like it should have been just a Power Geyser. It's, it's just, it covers more. The problem is, is Mario does have meter. You can react with 2 and 4 C and it just blows through it. Rock's That's harder true. to react through it. Uh, oh, oh my god, uses the belly spot after the forced air option. Oh. Okay, easy reset, yeah. you know? Easy reset. It, Set point, Mario. It is unfortunate they did use that body splash, but they weren't able to EX cancel out of it. Keep it safe. Now, Mario, gonna take the momentum from that round and turn it into their favor. It's a good old handshake. Just dash up 2A. What you gonna do about it? I'm doing a faster move. Oh, yeah. Catches a no tech? and then gets a whole other combo. Mario's just doing it. Combo's lasting just long enough to secure the cycle. Just get hit. Do it now, again. One more time. It's a good button. And has, has the meter, has the VO, gonna be able to see you at the end of this should they choose to? No, to it's not gonna kill. Yeah. He knew. He knew it wasn't gonna kill. Oh my god, he maybe could have done it there, though, and it actually would have killed. Doesn't need it, though. Doesn't need it, though. Good job, Mario! <laughs> Mario taking it 2-0 over Tannison. Yeah. I expected that. You know, I, I thought it could have gone either way, but Mario just showed no, that dominance. Mario's nice. Mario once again proved the theory that mm -hmm. all the successful Wagner players are in wonderful, loving relationships. Yeah, it's too strong. Like, it's pretty strong. We can, we can break it down. Mario, right? Right? Fendo? Yeah. Red Blade? And yeah. Randy's a Seth player. So, uh, that's really messed up. Wow. <laughs> you really said that about him. Oh my god, I got this? Yo. This isn't mine. It's yours now. No, it isn't. It's, we're gonna we're gonna right. put her in the middle. We're gonna put her in the middle. She'll live there. She'll live there. <laughs> <sighs> this is a horse character. Is, is this a horse or a toho? This is a. This is. Is this a horse or a toho? 
Is this a horse or a toe ho? It's a, it's a toe ho. Thank God. It's a toe Thank God. I'm cool with it. We're what, good with you don't it. Like, you don't like horses? You don't, you don't like Uma Musume? They made too many, like, modern gacha games, in my opinion. You know? I felt like at one point it was like, man, we got a bunch of boats coming out. Yeah. And then it was like, now it's horses. And I'm like, what's going on, man? Well, which boat one? Because there's been three of them. Exactly. Exactly. <laughs> too many boat ones. <laughs> And now it's all like gun ones. Yeah. I'm like, what's going on with that? Yeah. What's going on? Asian countries producing gotcha games. Well, they have the market research. They know that they know that the people want the gun girls, and, that, and they also wanted the horse girls before. And they're gonna now want. I think it's gonna be like sports cars. I think that'd be cool. I think a racing. I think gotcha. sports cars are hard to get license wise. Though. That's that's the issue for that's that. That's true. Right. That's like, true. I know the horse ones are already in like trouble with the yakuza. Like you can't make special art of those. Yeah, like, that, it's, it's dangerous all, territory. It's a, it's a whole thing. Speaking of dangerous territory, Meganicon Aria. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is not a safe phone on. I'm gonna be like super honest right now. This is a whack winners match. These players should be in losers. <gasps> They're whack. I should I should have been in their pool. Not so, this is, I'm just being mean. They're both goaded, you know. Meganicon, yeah. SoCal, San Diego, Nanase, Aria, yeah. goaded, PNW, phone on. Brit one of the British Columbia boys making their trek down here. Always, I always love when, the, when they're able to come out. You know, it's a little bit more costly for them just due to the like exchange rate and all yeah, that. So when they, yeah. they can make those trips, especially for events like Slashback, it's a wonderful time. Yeah. California? It's a little expensive. California? Here? Yeah, I've paid like $25 on average for a meal or something. Yeah, it's a little but. bad at times. It's a little bad, but you know, I think, I don't know. This is strange. I feel like I rate these players pretty similarly in terms of like where I would put them in my skill bracket of like, yeah, they're nice with it. I, I, I may be the slight bias here. I put Arya slightly above. I think just Arya has a very consistent game plan versus the entire roster. Magonicon can sometimes be a little bit lacking in the That's grand scale of things. That's fair. Oh, and right now Arya's just doing it. You know, you're yeah. doing some Nanase stuff. Other side after the funny hop. You got the cycle. Nice block there. Yeah. Oh, Scary that was whiff. almost close, but just slightly too spaced out after the cross. But we'll just find this next little hit right here. Has the 200 meter to cash out should they want to close out the round. Easy yeah, combo. Will. Easy 200. Doesn't kill. Oh my okay, goodness. you know, Meganicon was mashing. <laughs> you know, I respect that, though, because sometimes players will play a little bit passive even when they have that big life lead, just because it, it's on their laurels, right? So if you try to take an advantage on a round that you're probably already losing, you yeah. might make a comeback. It's fair. It's fair. Right now, Arya's just doing some fair stuff, getting a hit. Getting another hit there. You know, maybe Lorenzo thought the drop wasn't good enough. It was. It was, and now you're getting comboed, you're in the corner, Arya's got a cycle, almost at 200 meter again. Yep. Oh, and finding a great opening after that, that air shield attempt. Unfortunately, you're dead. Gone. Yeah, this time guaranteed with that life being low enough. And that's a quick Clear round one for, uh, for Arya. All right, uh, uh. Meganicon, <laughs> he is San Diego, but he's originally NorCal. I, I, why would I not be cheering for Sean? <laughs> Let's go, let's go BC! No, let's not go BC, let's not go BC. Oh, uh, okay. All right, you know, already got a hit, doing all right. We, all, we always root for BC here. I mean, that's fair. I'm Brit always gonna, oh man, he's British dying. British Columbia stands for best combos because we're landing them. We're not getting any resets. We're not getting any drops. That was a drop right there, I saw That it. was a re intentional reset. All right, all right, it worked. You know, he got the next hit. <laughs> Pretty good from Aria. Pretty good. Oh, that's a punish. That's the first big hit. That was really yeah. bad. You just have the slight delay on the tech right there from that uh, meeting not going to fully connect. It is still a Gonicon's chance. Great that green shield, shield could have no. been punished. No. Okay, nice shield on the overhead. Oh, man, that was scary. It worked out. Nice. DPing over the funny overhead move. Yeah, it works keep, out. Keeping it just really calm right now, but Arya oh, throwing the throw at the last moment. Still at a pixel. DP that. You can't I DP. was wrong. You, you, DP was correct if Arya did not have that dog in them, the 2-2-C two, two right there. I was so wrong. Oh my god, DP plus frames just like that. All right, nice little air yeah. fireball. That was good. Okay, Arya's cooking right now. Yeah, know? of course they are. Of course Arya is cooking. They know what they're doing. They know what they have to do to close this oh, out. Oh, no. cross up. Come on. Okay, you know, you got hit by that early, you got hit by it again. It's fine. You have your opportunity. The 6FF whiffing, thankfully. You know, that move uh, should lose all of its rights. <laughs> oh, that move should yeah. also lose its rights. 6 c or, or uh, 2 2 c is such a great tool for Meganicon, and not to say as a whole, just to be able to close these distances against Phononin, try yeah. to like regain pressure. 
And they almost did it, but Arya still was able to block it out. Oh, they plus stay frames. Oh, nice anti-air. That's the anti-air yes, button. It hits like a huge. truck. It hits everything. You're getting a combo. You got that cycle. You got some EX spending. Okay, but you, you know. don't have the setup over there after that. The sword car whiffs. So now Arya gonna be able to find the knockdown. Find the shield that. Up okay, doesn't yeah. shield it, but actually gets a, a hit still afterwards. I don't know how or why. Uh, enough landing recovery because it was still slightly above. I think. I but guess. here we are. DPC. All right, well, you know, good showing in the last round. Good stuff to Arya. Staying alive in winners. Yeah. Good stuff. Doing it for the North. Making that phone on work. Doing it for the North. SoCal lost. I'm happy. <laughs> SoCal lost. It's the ultimate OS. It is. It's the ultimate it is, OS. you know. We bring up history when it's good for us. We bring up the present when it's better. <laughs> Speaking of oh. the present in the history, yeah, clearly and brick here next. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So this is—is is this the first time that they have played since like Evo 2019? Probably, because Rakir wasn't at crossover art. Yeah, clearly hasn't been at a lot of North American things. I don't yeah. think Rakir has been a lot of Japanese things. No, no, he's been on that streamer grind set. You know, yeah, doing the good work there. It's been a lot of time in Street Fighter Six as well. I really? Know. I think I think they are, they might be on like one of the Street Fighter League teams. I can't remember exactly, but I know they were playing a lot of Street Fighter Six. That They're drop. probably in one of those like actual good player master rank point numbers. Oh, definitely. You know, not that definitely. beginner master rank, like yeah. good master yeah, rank. Yeah, you know, none of none of that. That was it, not fifteen hundred. Yeah, fifteen hundred. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. No, nah. probably like let's say seventeen I'm at least. I have no 18. idea how good I that think is. 18. I, I think have no idea how it's, good. It's Elo. Okay. Uh, um, but what's like the top? Where's Daigo? You know, I don't know where Daigo is. Is Daigo like 2K? Is Daigo's it 3K? at the top of the, 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 the Twitch page with those viewer numbers. I don't think he cares about the MR grind. I think he's just there to play, there to stream, there to grind. Money is worth more than mastering points. And right now, this is an opportunity for money. This is into top eight. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No mastering points ga uh, gained here. Your Street Fighter mm. 6 Elo will not move. But your position in the bracket will. Your position in top eight will. Yeah, yeah, one yeah. Person yeah gets to say, qualifier. One person gets to say, I'm there. Yeah. I made it. I, I got my medal. I got my money. You're guaranteed fifth place. Yeah, winner's side. Winner's side top winner's eight. Side top not, just, not just into the loser side. Not just guaranteed. Okay, straight by in there. Prestigious. Yeah. Prestigious. Rakir, you know, bad body language. That's not good. But clear lamp, you know, just like having a fun time. But got the extra hand attachments. It's very fortunate for Clearlamp. He got into the players he's like known for a long time side of the bracket, right? That's so true. he's able to like I think be a little more comfortable with them, and I think that is actually helping his game plan, right? He's not like as everyone's like, oh, who's this new North American kid that's coming around, right? Speaking of new North American kids, though, Wondrekia is actually the one being played. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He, you know, newer character came out last version, better this version. I can say he truly came into form this version. Yeah, I do know Kirillam has played this character in a bit on like the JP Netflix circuit. You gotta, you know? Yeah. You gotta get your hours in and be ready to get into a position like this in the bracket. Sick punish on the green shield. Yeah, though. yeah, that's super sick round for Rakir right now. You're just controlling it out. Oh, you threw out a button while you were had the little chili debuff. Yeah, you need a sweater. That's exactly what Rakir wants you to do. To see that Clearland is willing to commit right into Rakir's game plan is going to be great. Trying to find that green shield punish once again, but instead going to get teched out. And now Clearland has a chance. You got the cycle. You got the corner presence. Yeah, overhead block, but you don't see us. I'm not going to be minus there. My turn. Oh, so fast. Such a fast low after the fun yeah, spin. Yeah, yeah. That's. Footsies, you, you kind of. Footsies, yeah. Show, showing what, showing footsies to NorCal. Keeping them in the honor, showing that what Showing footsies to, to Clearland. <laughs> to Clearland, getting the first throw, though. You know, that's what you need. You need to just get that pressure going. Nice shields on these. Yes. Yeah, back dash oh. after that. So scary. Yeah, such a great delay right there. Now we're here just going to be able to go back into the basics of play, and I think it's been working out great for them, right? Like, not, not creating any big opportunities after, but guaranteeing the cycle, guaranteeing the knockdown, but guaranteeing to get hit by the 2 cc Yeah, that's good. You know, you get out, you're able to start building things, you get a good throw and get the cycle for it, too. Sick TRM into the corner with you, Rakir. Hold the strike throw. Hold it. Yeah. Watch out. Doesn't have to hold yeah. it. Ice Storm. They were, they were holding until they didn't need to, but same thing with Clearland, finding the great reverse opportunity and finding that 5A, getting it to connect. Just hit it, hit it three times. You're holding back, you were hitting them. 
You got all that meter now. Rick here spent on that Ice Storm. Didn't work out. Clear Hunt had the cycle, oh. got 25 back for the reversal. And you're at 200 meter. We're looking like a web setup coming. No, never mind. Never mind. It's got, fine. Had, had the whiff on the record right there as well. Clearly, I'm already ready. Not going to let those like free resets get ahead of him. And these five ARs have been so on. Yeah, you know, you got DP. You got knocked down. Whatever. My turn. Oh, nice. Good oh, Theo, yeah. Escape. There's that low. The sliding is so, so strong. Oh, the drop's really unfortunate here. You have to get something good off of this Ice Storm. Scary whip. Oh, shield last hit. Oh, and 5B going to connect from the tip of that range right there. That move that has been so poor to, I think, not only, look, Jerky Hold, but here's game plan right now. Oh, yeah. And that move's one of them. Oh, the really late high. Really, really late there. The setup was safe because the flower. It looked like it could have been empty low. Clearland got hit by it. Pretty good setup. Yeah. And I think that's, that's been a big thing with Rakir is trying to find all these micro, like, adjustments that you can make on these setups to keep people constantly guessing. Yeah, you just... On Landreki, it's so strong. Because yes. the frame data changes with every Rekka. You got a backdash, you got a DP. You got to be very fluid with your options. Once you're like that, you can make spacings in your favor, just like that jumping. You know, beat Assault so cleanly. And that's just showing that knowledge, showing exactly that Rakir knows what they need to do. Clear Limbo finding a nice little red beat right there. And gonna find an opportunity to block out of these records, shield them appropriately, and get the guaranteed punish. Oh yeah, so nice. Very consistent. Okay, you know, maybe maybe not as consistent as you need to be right now. Nice. Yeah. Gets the shield on the EX there. Actually, does not get the debuff. That was a little bit scary to shield. Oh, oh that no. connected onto it! Man, the Dragon has got some buttons. Yeah. He's got some buttons. Oh. Webs jumps into it. So yeah. many plus Just want, wanted to just clear it out there because it's so much scary to have those webs on screen that deal with the Beyond Frank coming through. Clearly, they're going to take advantage of that little hit right there. It almost reset him with oh, the DP. Really connect. smart. Really smart. You know, it could have been a nice setup with, at the CS there if the plus strength happened. Good punish. A little too antsy, maybe. A little too You know, a lot of the DPs are working. Yeah. If one DP doesn't happen, you can take half your life just like that. But I think it's also fine to risk it. Like, you have some games to, you know, get the download information, yeah. figure out exactly what they're going to do. And now that they've got the, okay, they're going to punish on DP, Rakir's going to have these opportunities to find turns to steal. We'll see if it can happen in this uh, post-knockout situation. But what's scarier is letting Clearlamp have time to adapt scarier than you having time to adapt? Yeah. I think it might be. It, I, I think it might it be. Is. And we're seeing it right here. No DP out this time, though, but a throw does connect one more touch. Oh, oh man, that was weird. Yeah. Oh man, you gave Clearlamp a little bit of time to adapt, and now it's going scary. Yeah. That's a big momentum shift. Yeah, especially with that perfect as well. Clearly, you're trying to do some of the a little bit more saucier tech, right? You you do the delay six two three C to catch them after they block it, and you can blow up these a lot of these attempts that people try to get out because of the command grab. You know. Rakir took a little bit of time at the screen there. That's good. That was a fast yeah. round. Take time to breathe. Bring it back. Yeah, and we saw Rakir getting very antsy, right? Like, always trying to be pretty aggressive with their presses, with their DPs. And now, they're channeling that aggression into a little bit more patience, and it's working out for them. Yeah. Get that patience, and when you do the JC at the right time, it does hit the whole screen. Nice TRM. Whoop. Funny 60. It's so funny. Nice tech out. Ice Storm. Yeah, it's always your turn when the hail is abound. And yeah, oh, just spaced yeah. out perfectly with that, like, minus two Rekka. I mean, like, being minus two in that situation is so beneficial for one Rekka. Yeah. Always being able to make your opponent be constantly guessing. Great 5A to get rid of that flower, though. Challenge it so fast. So nice from Kuram. Has the cycle, has the meter. Life is a deficit, but you know, you don't get chipped out in this game. You got to get hit for real. Yeah. And there's only 50 seconds left, you know, and the odd combos do take a little bit of time, but we're here not going to allow any combos right now as they're not letting Clearlamp get any more downloads at yeah. match point. Get that setup out of here. I'm spending 100 meter, my turn. Plus frames, you have a debuff now. Hold my neutral. Oh, yeah, the backdash there. Oh, what Clear a great throw right there. Oh, man. Only the second hit of the Rekka. 
Ooh, Kai got a counter hit. DP. Yeah. Had to DP basically that the whole last round and a half right now. Making those adjustments to, you know, constantly keep them against the hand. Going to still do this. You have to be worried about this option. And we'll see how clear it responds to that after this knockdown. Putting up the spider jail. One, two, three. See some webs. Let's see what the options roll. Yeah. Roll generally being pretty safe here. You think your opponent's going to be trying to bait out a DP right there. Yeah, Gets the side swap on their own pressure. All right, now you're gonna pressure plus frames. Didn't shield the debuff. Oh, scary. Didn't actually get block it. Oh no, the whiff. Yeah. The unwhiffable move. A whiff sometimes. The clear lamp is already prepared for that. Oh, get your setup, clear lamp. Hold it down. You just need like a hit or a throw in the web. Yeah. Oh, but it's counter thrown. Yeah, and gets crossed up with the overhead right there. Oh, oh. low drop. Yeah. It could have been really close. With Fury's at 200 meter. Oh, no, no, no. That doesn't have invuln on it. You're in range. Yeah. The, I, the storm is not here today. Bad forecast. Okay. Nice. Oh. To be connecting at that perfect spacing. And I think it's really a, like a big adjustment for Clear Lamp and this. They're always forcing themselves back into that 2B5C range, right? Never wanting to allow for here to be spaced out and play their own turn. Doesn't get the cross up, but still putting them in the spider's web. 5BB going to connect as you didn't have enough meter to build 2 3 6 Really unfortunate. You know, you getting hit like that, it's, it's bad for the game. It's bad for the mental as yeah. well. You know? I guess it's obvious. It's like, you know, I got hit by that. Oh, that's bad for the mental in game as well. Yeah, good mental reset for Clear Lamp as well. Getting a little bit of a oh. pause, but now get stuck to the ice. You need to chill out, Clear Lamp. The aggression is getting to you as we're here. Finds one more knockdown potentially to lead into a round with Throw situation. Before the flower. Throw before the flower. Other side, IW. Oh, God. It hits. It's. Not, not gonna kill. Enough. Not gonna kill. But it's very. It should have been IWEX. If it was IWEX, it probably would have still worked. Oh, yeah. you don't need it. Nice from Clearland. Going back to Fundy's. Not trying to do anything strike. crazy. Strike. Strike throw. Wait for that green shield and immediately punishing on that flash. So nice. So nice. Excellent. Man, that was scary though. Yeah, it was. It was. It was terrifying, but it was oh, also yeah. fantastic because it was anyone's game. Anyone's like literally, job. the the last micro decision could have caused. The carry looked so so strong. Yes. And then, like game two is just like a landslide, yep. and then still a very close game three, super close. Man. Yeah. Speaking cool. of things, maybe close, maybe far. Well, they'll, we be on, they'll be far away from each other for a long bit if Klim's game plan will work out because we have Klim versus F6ZQYGETI2YQLRU3. Also known as the, the SoCal Eltnum. SoCal Eltnum. Beat Prem Great. earlier. Yeah. Another winner's qualifier match. The yeah. person who wins this, top eight, fighting a crazy, crazy having, gamer. Ha having to fight Clear Lamp. Yeah. You know, there's part of you that I think in this scene, it's like, man, I want to make top eight. But I also want to make maybe, maybe top eight loser side. So yeah, maybe not, the, maybe not that side. You yeah, know? Yeah, I mean, yeah. if you get into that match, you go into, like, the other side of the bracket. So you, you have some time to avoid clear yeah. But key is inevitable. Key is inevitable, you know? There's no, we don't have Deffy, we don't have mm -hmm. Big Black, mm -hmm. we don't have like Fox Off, mm -hmm. we don't have, any, uh, some of the, the Warriors have been consistently able to knock them out of tournaments. Yeah, I don't know if any of the players in this tournament have a set on Clear Lamp. I did see some game, th some of them gaming earlier and like they were able to take some of the casuals, but the tournament standpoint? Tournament's hard. Tournament's a scary place to be against I someone like that. I don't think any of them do, because I think all of them. There's maybe, potential, though. Maybe. We saw a lot of potential just happen. Well, because he, he didn't, Clear Lamp didn't make it that far in Taco 2023. Yeah, he lost to Captain Sugar. Right. Who's not right, here, right, yeah, so yeah. unfortunately. Rest in peace, Tom. Rest in peace, Tom. And now, one of these players losing one of their lives. Yeah. One of them staying alive. We'll see him later. SoCal Oldham, Klim, classic players. British we'll Columbia Mercava. Let's go BC. Let's go BC. Let's go BC. You know, if there's one thing I can cheer for, it's anything north of SoCal. <laughs> anything north of SoCal. Let's go North NorCal. Let's go North NorCal. Let's go North NorCal. Okay. Yeah. But this is gonna be this is gonna be another. This is a, we have a lot of the like legacy boomer matches happening. Some of these yeah. like old grinders all coming back out for Uni Two, and these two guys have played each other so much. Oh yeah. You know, this will be like standard stuff. Plus Uni Two shenanigans sometimes. Yeah. You know, who knows? Right now we're just seeing classic Merkava. What are you gonna do about Five C? You're 
you're not stopping the reboot potentials. You're not doing anything about it. Clem's going to take that advantage where they can. Get it set. And just keep the basic strike. Trying to use that 4B to check for these late, uh, like, MRA attempts. But Grant not having it. Just going to hold the pressure, but will also hold an opportunity to take a reset. Yeah, you know, drops happen. You get to execute on them. You get your corner. You get your bullets. You get your meaty. You get a strike throw afterwards. And you'll get another one. Third time charm. Just strike this time. Now trying to open up these frame traps because they're ready to block that overhead. Cutting sync. The move. Yeah. You have a hundred meter. Watch out. Rakava has that same move, but better. <laughs> And now Markov is dead. Yeah. I, I really like, so Clint didn't get punished off that 4B, but I like that 4B attempt right there, right? Because a lot of times Elden's just going to go for gunshot and we'll be able to connect it dur uh, during that gap. Ooh, really late assault hit there. Actually catching Grant out. Clem, good opportunity. Spends it on 100 for the, the kids. They're going to school. Oh, he's got hit by the kids. Oh, it's just a strike, man. What, what are you watching? What happened? You know, sometimes, sometimes strike, strike is the best mix you can do, right? But guns oh, work even so better, but it sad. won't reload. The whiff second on the gunshot yeah. and canceling just a little too late is really unfortunate. But now, Celestial could potentially be useful, but they're going to have to burn it to just gain a bunch of meter and try to use that pause. But Clem still finds the counter hit trade, looking like a Havoc hero right here, and should be able to close the round out. Being even on the whiff dive kick, spending only 100, it's enough. Because he knows, he has that field. Like, yeah, only 260 is going to kill. I don't need to catch an IW. I got to save that meter where I can to make that comeback. Green on the dive kick, but you EX afterwards. Yeah. Oh, no. Oh, no. You had such an opportunity. Oh, man. You try to contest the Elgin with an assault. A little scary. Really good round for Grant right now. This is a, the opportunity. This is the same sort of round start that we had in the last time, right? Like after Klim did their 5C, uh, 5A rebeats that Grant used to win that first round and now trying to make that opportunity happen again, but Klim pressuring themselves out. Oh, empty. A little scary, a little tricky. Oh, that's a good move. That's a good move. Shielding those are really important. Kind of hard, though. And now should be pretty simple, yeah, easy. You yeah. do some stuff in the IW, it kills like 90% of the time. Yeah, especially, you know, just like low life, just kept it simple, doesn't want to do anything crazy. There's Don't no, go for the extra gunshots, there's you know? No, there's no need to do that when you're at this stage of the bracket. You are fighting for top eight winner side. Yeah, yeah. Grant up the game. Clem, you know, they both just waiting at the screen. Not for that long, but you know, that's long enough sometimes. But it's enough for a breather, right? Like, yeah. Clem's one to very quickly reset their mental, and they can do it in-game even. That's, you know, one of their uh, their big strengths as a player. Yeah, you get some momentum, you get a nice little a fly in, you get a big old frame trap there, and now you're getting your second combo. You know, you only need like one more good one. Uh, maybe two now that you settle the babies. Yeah, well, it's oh, we're all getting punished. You only need one after this, unless you reset. Counter hit trade gonna give Grant another chance. Yeah, Grant really loves the charge sixes. I want to see some non charge sixes. They're so good, you know. Clemson been shielding them, but you know, it's yeah. We'll have to you know see if they can potentially come up right now. Oh, CS afterwards. Yeah. Oh, throw there. Scary. Come to the cycle. Watch out. Oh, oh, you had the cycle, you had meter, and you just mash, you just mash normally? Yeah, of course. You could EX mash. Oh my god, it didn't kill. Because you get an EX mash right here, but unfortunately, it's not going to work out. Grant saying very, very calm now, sitting match point. Yeah, that's, you know, you spent that IW, it barely didn't kill, and now you're getting a frame trap with the wire extension. Watch out. Nice little combo here. You're going to get your bullets, you're going to be gaming. Strike gaming. Stri oh, it was a throw as well. I said strike. I'm, even I'm getting mixed. Oh man, L and five A's like really good. It's it, 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 it's it's one of the five A's. It's one of the five A's. It's, five, it's a melty blood button that they put into this game, right? Like yeah, she's got some melty blood buttons. Yeah, I wonder now that super's good. Like oh, no more pity grid. Oh, he didn't fly. Yeah, wasn't gonna uh, cancel into it. I think that really messed Grant up on that, that secret trick. They're expecting it, so now Clem gets a chance to make that comeback. The no mix mix working out. Baby's holding down. My neutral is continuing. Yeah. And the pressure is continuing as well, completely holding them up. No shield for the cross up, gonna connect. Yeah, Mercada. This is all button goes and hits on both sides. Oh, a lot of the time, you know, you go under, I'm gonna dodge in the salt button, not against Mercada. You gotta watch out. Scary. Nice throw. Uh, not enough extra damage from the babies. Like, barely any. Oh, man. 2C is a really good button, in my opinion. It's really good. It's like a big two hit low? Yep. 
That's hmm, interesting. Now you get a fully special cancel. You can rebeat out of. You, 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 you can do it whatever. Gives you, it gives you the world and the whole oyster with it. Like you get, you get everything that you want to do. Sometimes it's a little too far, and you got to spend meter to confirm. But you know, still really good. Catches a backdash, gets Grant into winner side top eight. Yep, 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 yeah. Gonna be sitting nice and comfy there. Haven't fight clear lamp, so I think we're going to see them immediately hit that station, try to lab out a couple of responses, try to figure out exactly what they need to do. Clem, still alive in loser side. Yeah. You know, only has to win one more match to yep. get in top eight as well. But, yep, you know, yep. you find someone who's been in the gauntlet, yes. who's been through the trenches, yeah, clawing and, their way back. And depending on the person, sometimes that can really, like, give them an edge that is not uh, expected for a lot. Like, that momentum shift really allows them to pull forward. There are some murderers in the loser's bracket. Especially. you got to yeah. watch out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Especially with how stacked this tournament was, right? We've, seen the, we've, basically, we've only really got to see the winner side, right? Yeah. But... All the warriors that showed up basically made it out in the loser side. So yeah, they've been there. They've been fighting this whole yep. time. You yep, know? Yep. Who knows what's been happening over there? Yeah, Star GG's you know having some uh, some ups and downs right now through the event, so we're not able to fully see the live updates. Yeah, it happens. As it does. But you know things are happening. Yeah. People are probably yelling about it. You know, I'm, I think CG, one of the highest seeded players, third last year. Yeah, got upset in uh, pools and made it in the loser side. You know, that's a, that's a scary person yep. to see on the loser side. And as well, CG has been playing a lot of different games. He's bouncing around. You know, he got 7th uh, in Type Lumina. He got 4th in Gundam. It's um, pretty nice with it. It's a lot nice of medals. Like, but you have to be bouncing around. You have to have your mind shift. And if you aren't ready for that, if you're not that kind of person that can quickly make that shift, you know, someone like Klim, well studied in that. As yeah. Somebody who will enter oh, yeah. 32 games out of a 16-game tournament if he can. But... CG is one who's still sort of getting back into the flow of entering a bunch of different games. And they, you have to really, like, shake your mental sometimes to be able yeah. to get past that. These flashback days have been long. Yes. Yesterday, oh, yes. people were playing the whole day. From I was there from 10 a.m. till 1 in the morning. Yeah, pretty pretty gruesome. Yeah. And then you wake up and do maybe do it pretty again. close to doing it, to it again. Yeah, and it's, it's, in, like, CG's case, was it type Lumina? Top 16 was at 11 a.m. So you were up all day late, mm -hmm. went to bed, woke up, and then just immediately playing started immediately. Playing Hasn't tournaments. had a break. Immediately started playing in hard top eights of tournaments. Yes. Hard game? Ah, uh, Lumina, I don't think Lumina is that hard. Oh, it's kind of hard. Gundam? Gundam is hard. Gun That's Gundam. a scary, I, I was, scary I was game watch, sitting and watching it, just like waiting for, you know, waiting for this to start. And I was like, these guys are moving. Yeah, they're moving. They're in war. Yeah. They're in those robots. They're the Gundam. <laughs> They're the Gundams. Speaking of, these aren't Gundams, but these are players. But our next players are Rurik and Knots. Yeah, Rurik and Knots. Just going for the button check right now, making sure the setup's all good. I'm always a big proponent of button check every time you get onto a setup. Uh, just to get used to the delay. Every setup's delay, even if you have an identical PS5, an identical monitor, identical settings, there can always be a little bit of delay. Just you know, get maybe it it's used a little, Maybe it's a little colder at that time, yeah. you know? Maybe someone smells a little different. Well, Watch out, you know, be ready. Be yeah. prepared, be on your setup, be in the best state you can be. And especially for these players who are having to wait for the stream matches, right? So they're yeah. being, you know, just get, gets you rewarmed up a little bit. Yeah, you gotta wait a good amount of time before you're able to actually play sometimes. A little unfortunate, but you know, that's how it is when you're this far in the bracket. And these players are used to it, right? These players have been in the seat before. They are more than well to know about what's going on. I'm gonna get them. But you know, they're going to get each other. Knots should be on Seth. Seth's really good. Yeah, I feel yeah. like this matchup is probably a little bit better than the Wagner matchup as well. Oh, yeah. Yeah, most definitely. Wa so speed. The, the Wagner user matchup is not bad, but on, like, on paper, but in practice, it's a little difficult. And I, I hope they don't choose the training stage. I'm going to yell at them. Thank you. Thank you. Get off the training stage! Pit Park! Dang it. I think they're on the training stage. No, I, I think they swapped off. They swapped? They swapped I, mean, off. I, I, I thought they, they moved over. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're on Momiji Street. Let's get it. We love it. We do. Nice autumn leaves. Yeah. Nice autumn Seth color. Oh, the whiff of the 5A. Usually good enough. Not there. Yeah. The combo not good enough either. I love not picking a color to match Momiji Street as well. Trying to use those yellow orbs to hide in those yellow lights. Make sure Rurik's always on their toes right there. Gets a great run up as Rurik's just floating in the sky. You think he actually he picked the stage? He, I think he picked the stage because he would have selected. needs to pick up on yeah, that. Yeah, yeah. If Rurik doesn't pick up on that, that's dangerous. You got you to hit that random button. Th this is also a stage that is hard to see gold throws on sometimes. Yeah. So, you know, that's something that's, that's going to be looking for with uh, those TRM attempts with the orb set with the command grab. All the different tools. So we'll Loki see what Rurik can do. Oh, counter hit. 
Ooh, or whiffs too. This probably makes the route a little bit better as well. Doesn't actually need it, you know? It, it's just a kill. Spend it. Oh, yeah, and I love using that chain chip right there. Be able to refund a little bit of that meter gained or, or spent right there. So you're and, not fully out, right? And get some from the grid blocks you had. Because yep, yep, yep. that super takes forever. He doesn't kill until the last hit. Nice hit for Ruriko. Oh, 2FF not going to connect, so they need to create a new, uh, another opportunity to keep this game going, and that is that opportunity right there. Not just swinging and just use you constantly above. You're not able to reach with your, your 5cc. It's good. It's not that good, though. Now we're getting a little oh. damage. Another throw, though. Yeah, waiting to see the reaction, see if they were, like what they were going to do on reaction control board. Knox is just willing to hold it, so instead you're getting tossed out of it. Oh, nice shield. Yeah, now you're actually going to punish it. Yeah, dash up. I'm in your face, Yuzu. Be afraid. Be yes. very afraid. Oh, nice oh, great teleport out. Like, not having to you know, stay inside that entire range. Yeah, the oh, entire was coming. Oh, the JA was coming, but they yeah. were just at the same jump part. They were just moving with each other. Oh, the orb missed. Nice teleport away from it. You stayed yeah. in the air a little too long, could have got tagged. Rurik is very good at waiting for that exact timing on the uh, the orbs and immediately teleporting so they can't get hit by it. And you're going to see that happen once again right here. Doing some great rewards. See Slash Ender. Get a nice 100. Teleport. Extra damage. Well, barely secures the cycle. Dashed all the way up. Watch out, Yuzu. Oh, the throw! And now using that 2FF, getting the new routes, adding a little bit of extra damage right there. And I love that drop actually just charged a little bit, right? Try to get in the cycle, but something really to just shield and be able to get One shield. Yuzu's a good dispenser at times. You know, yep. you see her at full screen, just like, oh, I'm going to get the cycle for free. It's mine. But now, the setup. The time. Oh, not. Yuzu in the corner. Watch out, Rurik. Oh, nice block in the self, JP. Throw coming out. And do it again. Staggering. Nice. You know? We're just using the good Seth buttons. What, we're trying to react to that green shield, but was a little late on it, just oh. like there, but still finding the opportunity to work. Come in, grab the CS. It's a kill. It's gotta be. You have 200 meter in this game. It's gotta be. He's extending a lot. Yeah. Normal yeah, yeah, IW, yeah. Just, it's, abs it's absolutely. Yeah. I definitely, it's absolutely. Once, once you're past that like 10% health mark, every IW is a guaranteed kill. It's like yeah. minimum a couple, like I, I think 1,200 command, damage or command something. Grab, like command grab combo of CS into IW, you get like 3K. Yeah. yeah. And that was definitely 3K. Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. Game one knots. Yeah. One away from winner's side. Showing the strength of Rurik. Already switching the aggression up. This is like one thing I love about Rurik's game plan, right? Is he's very willing to just constantly ebb between the hyper defensive and hyper aggressive game plans. And it works out great because your opponent's never really able to connect what is going on at the start of any round. It's Rurik, you know, showing that and showing that they can't be as aggressive as they were in the previous matches that we saw because Knots is ready for him with those anti airs. He's such anti air comparable, you know? Yeah. He swings this thing up in like a good way. He's using it properly. You know, he's not the biggest stick. He can't sw hit the whole screen, but he hits enough. He has some good head and bone. He's getting hit though. He had the cycle. This is unfortunate. He's not dead. Still no. opportunity. But you will die after that little hit right there. Wasn't ready for the flip to come through. Hadn't really seen that come out in that pressure sequence just yet through these games. So, oh, the whiff dash scene, the EX cancel yeah. actually catching out. Doesn't get a full combo of conversion, but you oh. know, 2K, and you didn't get murdered for that. Yeah, I'm yeah. pretty. You'd be pretty happy with that. 100 meter, I'm chilling. Oh, most oh 100 meter, you're getting a hit and chilling as well. Yeah, vacuuming them down uh, from up in the sky, but we're confident to just press those two A's using all that Akatsuki practice. Sick of all right. Sick, sick of all right. Spend 100, get 25 back. Great deal. Oh, oh two, two of them. Is did it at him. Oh, he could have killed. He could have hit three buttons and hit three buttons again. Yeah, but you know he didn't want to. He wanted to show the style. Wanted to give Seth a chance. Say, hey, what are you gonna do? I, oh, I, I wouldn't give Seth a chance. I wouldn't either. But we're feeling confident. I wouldn't give Seth a chance. That's a that's a bad way for this to go. Oh no. Oh no, watch out. Yeah, oh, I in the air. <gasps> Dodge is yeah. orb too. But no punishing. You saw Dodge be ready for that and just went for the delay on the dash block. Hey, Yuzu was in stance. It's scary. Oh, nice dash. Good yeah. handshake. 2A. Hold my five frame. That was, that was scary. It was very, very scary. That was right? scary. Rurik staying alive. Yeah. 1-1. One, one. But it's anyone's game, right? We've seen these game. go so you back know, and I want, forth. I so. want Knots now to go back to carry select. Like select a more messed up color and a more messed, messed up, up stage. Because yeah, yeah, yeah. Rurik didn't catch on and swamp. Like a park and like the dark green orb. 
That'd be pretty good. Park on the Dark Green Worm on the P1 side corner or like, super, super hard. Or like the the blue rooftop stage and like some really dark blue set. Yeah, that one's pretty nasty. Yeah, you, I almost want to yell, but Rua could hear it. Not wearing <laughs> headphones. Well, it's the power up. He needs it that is a power up. Yeah, yeah, the yeah. person who won Kohi Mate was not using the headphones. No. Let's see what Rua does here. Well, right now we're oh, trying, over the five CC. trying to have those shades of footsies like those Kohime players have. Oh, a strike throw. That's what you like to see. You get a combo as Yuzu. Yeah. You know, these ranged characters getting combos after the throw, sick tech back. Command grab. Can't tech that one. Uh, oh, the oh. green shield came out. Oh, that was so scary. Yeah, but it's, that's the confidence of being able to green shield in those situations and not get grid broken. But you will get grid broken on that crowd shield attempt right there as soon as you get hit with the axe kick. Oh, yeah. A little early. You were not reacting. You were guessing. Guessing was good. Yeah. But, you know, sometimes you guess wrong. Sometimes you got grid broken. Sometimes you get thrown. Yeah. I mean, you have to accept those guesses. Just like you have to accept those guesses on those two A's when they do end up working out. Finding the good hit, it confirms no side swap. Ended a little early. Oh, yeah, yeah. you're not plus there. You're not plus there. You're just a little minus. Yeah, a little. You can space it out normally, but keep staying right on top of Seth. At, with that amount of minus, he's able to punish him very, Crazy. very. Oh, just EXDP gets a big old hit. No orb. No orb. Normal strike throw. Yeah, sometimes that's what you gotta do. And sometimes work knows that they just have to keep these combos going, keep the zoning up. Oh, oh no, yeah. you didn't fuzzy mash against Rurik. But they oh. haven't brought that out yet, basically the whole set, right? Yeah. So it's been something that you even though oh Rurik's not gonna do it yeah. and at the exact right moment. It works oh, out in their favor just man. like that two-way press right here. Yeah. The close range Yuzu offense. We've seen a lot of far range, we've seen a lot of good hits, some big slashes. We haven't seen the close range stuff from Rurik a ton. Yeah. So and it's good to see that coming out now when it matters. Yeah. Especially like that. It's working out great. It's always like messing knots up. They're always like, I'm not exactly sure how we're trying to be fighting, but they will use those big presses like that to try to challenge at some safer spaces. Slash your thing around. Hit 5C twice. Yeah. Boom. 3.4K. Pretty good. 4K. Over 4K. 4.1. 4.1. Okay. We're hanging out. Cycle knots. And I love that just float back, don't do anything. Like, don't need to go to Sans, don't need to try to slash. Just reset your pressure sequences right here. As hang out. You know, hanging out is a little bad for the cycle. You know, not securing it. Didn't see us in that last cycle, so, you know, you didn't get the grid. Yeah. But you. Scary. Very scary. We're just hanging out. Oh, oh whiff punish. Yeah. Absolutely not. And this is huge, having the cycle as well. Going to be able to keep it up through these routes and get a bunch of damage, go to like 4.4K. Spending 100, getting 25 back, staying at the 100 mark as well. Oh man, I'm afraid. I'm afraid he's going to do something crazy. It's a one-touch situation Ooh, grab! with the CS as well. Knox yes. closes it out. Super nice, super nice. Really good sets. Yeah. Knots, second place last year. Winner's top eight this year. Yeah, yeah, fighting on the side that you don't have to fight clear land until winner's finals either. Don't Pretty have to fight good the winner deal. That match. Pretty good deal. Yeah. Rurik, loser side, still alive. But Rurik is very confident. The, the loser side top eight is a position that he's been in a lot before. You know, usually from this starts up in winner's side, has to then call through the losers. You don't see him in seventh a lot. No, you, you know, see him past that seventh it, match. And once you're past that, you're, had, you're in a good, yeah, good yeah, spot. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So excellent stuff from them so far. Good stuff on Randy for making it in. Let's go. Let's go, Randy. He's like almost NorCal. He's like as NorCal as Rurik. They're like the same distance in terms of friendship and location. I thought Randy was SoCal. He is, but he's close. You so know, Snappy, Snappy is like an extension of Randy. So they're like... No, I'm, I'm like doing a map in my head. Don't like, do the map. We'll just talk about the sponsors instead. No, that's true. We can talk about our lovely sponsors, like Slashback's merch store. It's official. It's by us. It's tight. It's so cool. And it's, it's so available cool. now. It's not going to be available forever. Until April. April 22nd right there. So you can check out that QR code or slashback.info forward slash shop. And you can check out all these sick, sick designs. I will be buying some as soon as I get back from here, making sure I get all those cool merch, just like all the cool merch that Tenno has. And you got to do it fast. It's running out. Who knows how much it is? Who knows what's coming back? Who knows what the stock is? Yeah. The people at Tenno do. And you can find out if you go to merch.tenno.dg or use the QR code. With the fancy Tenno logo in the center as well, showing it's personalized. And these shirts can be personalized. Show them how good QR codes are. Yeah. You can have stuff like that. In them. It's crazy. Speaking of things that are crazy. Blazing Strike is a crazy retro and modern styled 
fighting game developed and uh, or, uh, being developed by an indie studio published by Axis, and it's going to have rollback netcode. We love to see rollback netcode yep. that makes it playable for everyone. You can run online brackets, you can go in person, and you can probably buy it pretty soon. They have that limited edition yeah. too. Soundtrack, character cards, an art book. That's a, yep. that's a pretty good, that's it, a good it, page it, art book. It's a sick art book. They already have gameplay on YouTube, so make sure to check that out. You can see a little bit of what the idea of the game is. I'm super excited for it, and I cannot wait for it to come out. Just like I cannot wait for the World Serpent Championship, the Global Blaze Blue Central Fiction Online Major. Starting soon, April to May, fight for your continents. Mm -hmm. Yes, not just your country, your, your continent. continent. Be a world, be a globalist. Yes. Fight in Blaze Blue. Sign up at start.gg slash WSC2024. Check out the Discord mm -hmm. link, bit.ly. Don't, you know, just big. It's there on the screen, man. Check it's that all out. Big shout outs to Chickzama for helping host that and running a lot of the stuff there. One of the big proponents of Blaze Blue in our scene. They're always putting in good work. Support your countries, not locals. No. Nope. Well, support your locals as well. Support, support your, your locals as well. Support your locals because if you support your locals, you support. get events like Slashback. Exactly. So we get events like these next games. Aria versus Mario. Mario, the local, the GOAT, last year's champion. Aria, invader. But also, my GOAT. You know, it's good to have your GOAT. It's <laughs> my GOAT won last year, yeah, but and he's going to win. Win, Mario! But my GOAT? It's playing a Your bad just got punished. It's, Your yeah. just got punished bad so match, bad. It's a bad matchup. We already have the OS down. Don't worry about that. Arya will still be able to clutch it out, though. Oh, right seems now. good. You didn't OS there, though. Yeah. You got to strike thrown just like that. And now you're getting shield and grid broken. What's going on? Oh, oh. mix-up. That's a real mix-up in this game. Yeah, Messed yeah, yeah. up. Messed up. Kill. Kill. CIW. Yep, yep, yep. The crowd is chanting some obscenities right now for Aria, trying to get them to power up. But those headphones playing the game too loud. They can only hear themselves right now because they are feeling themselves with these combos. You know, nice two-way. It was a good little handshake there. You got your combo. You got 3K. Now you're on the offense. Mario's got to escape this somehow. But, you know, he's chill the block. You know, you got the cycle. You're hanging out. 6FF, that's a little nasty. Yeah, where's the hip? Where's the hurt box? I don't know. I don't well, know. We'll have to see if you can find out right now, but a throw comes out. It's going to be draining that grid. Huge down, so you will have to use that CS at the next gap. Little and they find late. it right at the last second. Aria does get the cycle, though. Scary jump back. No plus frames there. Yeah. No plus frames there. Mario got your good old 5A. Five frames, get a 3K, get two buffs. Nice tech back. Yep. Oh, nice a great tech. tech. Back. Yep. Oh, oh, the best throw. Mario not close enough. Yeah, didn't get the dash throw right there. Close oh, enough, but Aria no. can't finish their play. Oh, so Mario no. will take advantage of this. Take all the advantage you need. Hold the strike there. Oh, that was a scary with 5 feet there. The frame data on that is not the best. Oh. Aria jumped or did something funny there. Yeah, There's I, an extra bounce here. Yeah, a little scary job. Okay, yeah. it's fine, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. Game one, Mario. It's all good. Keeping it, keep it calm, keeping it collected. Let's go, Mario! He's doing good. <laughs> He's doing good. I think he is in a good position. Mario's taking some time, you know, yeah. but Mario's a good thinker. Mario's a great Ma Ma thinker. Mario is a very solid thinker, and Aria also needs to be, have an even bigger brain at this point. They're finding a lot of these great round start opportunities, as we've seen a couple times, but Mario has just been able to capitalize on it later yeah. in these rounds. That was quite the counter hit, in my opinion. Oh, Mario getting tagged. Maybe it was a drill, maybe it was an assault, I don't know. Yeah. Mario with the cycle and a 100 meter. Good old DPCS. Plus frames for days. The same way as the round start. Yeah. I don't like that. I don't like that from him. I'm gonna like if it happens again. I'm gonna yell at him. I shouldn't do that. That's co that's actual coaching. That's we coaching. shouldn't do that. Yeah. We shouldn't do that. I, I will report you to the TO desk. They know me. They might let it just, slide. Just because you're NorCal, you can't get away with coaching. Okay, okay, okay. okay, okay. okay. Aria, Mario can't get away right now either. He's uh, stuck yep. in the phone on pressure. Yeah, Mario Ooh, has been scary. locked down on there, but will find the CS with the DP to try to take their turn back. But they have a big gap to close, and this is a great starter. Counter at 6B, a great opportunity. And getting the hard combos as well. Let's go, Mario. Let's go, Mario. The 2-2, two -two, a little extra this version. You're on fire, Aria. Okay, that's yep. a little bad. Sword buff as well, so you have to respect the throw because combo throw will kill here. Wow, what a great what? press from oh Aria. Oh my god! 
No fear. You can't even be shielding against Wagner. You're on fire. You're still hitting 2B. You can't Crazy. have fear versus Wagner. If you have fear, they will take full advantage of it. And Arya knows that. They want to continue pressing again and again and again. Runs out of the funny 2-2 buff. It's okay. We got some plus frames off of DP. Mario of the cycle, though. Scary. Whoa. 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 That's a strike to you. It's a strike. No throw. Has meter on deck as well to go for the 2-2C. Get a guaranteed end with some high, high 4K damage right here. And oh, another great hit. Man. Aria, keep it clean right here. Oh, man. It's, it's yeah. good. It's good. Perfect for Aria. Perfect Let's go, Aria. Win it up, Aria. All right. They, and they're going right back in. Mario's fast yeah. about it. He's going <laughs> to get him. OK. Didn't get hit that time. Thank go Oh, six step up. No confirm, though. Chill, chill. Right. Nice tech back. You have such a good cycle lead. Oh, Counter hit. That's such a good the Mario confirm. 2 A's of legend. Oh, you know, that was a nice job. Mario 2 A's usually deal like 10% more damage, it feels like, but Aria not letting that phase them right here. Getting these side swaps, getting these knockdowns. And Mario, you have to cycle. You gotta, like, use it good right now. You gotta, like, get a good hit. You gotta, okay, yeah. Oh, yeah, okay. had the can with cancel onto the geyser right there, able to keep it up. Oh, the same no, side of mix. That was so weird. Oh no. Okay, Mario, you Aria, got this. Are you using using that Vancouver Blaze Blue Tech to get all these mix-ups working out great for them? Didn't hit afterwards. Or oh, throw, scary. throw, do it. I, I believe in you. Plus frames. Yeah, oh, no. let's go, Aria. Let's go, NorCal. <laughs> got need him to win. I mean, he's got he got to get a winner side. He's got to get a winner. Oh, oh yeah, yeah get over time. that two B. No more. Assault is goaded. That's a great, great big start for them. Two two C. Yep. Get your buffs. Get your buffs. Get your buffs. And I like Get that stagger pressure. Like not going for the, the whiff, JA, just respecting Aria a lot. And Aria not respecting their turns at all. Going to uh, be able to find uh, that big 2C connection. Yeah, Mario got a green shield on that second hit. Really scary. That was a scary whiff from Aria. Didn't get punished, thankfully. Yeah. And Unthankfully. I want Aria to get punished for that. Oh, C okay. Fireball. Big connection. Oh, Drop. no, but a whiff. Yes, 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 yes. Win, Mario. Win. It's your opportunity. That's a big mental boom. Two buffs. Watch out for the CS. I need you to lose Mario. I need the, uh, this Aria power up. You need to figure out your way. What can you do? Get shield shielded right now and throw. throw. Good You're throw. in a one-touch situation. Cycle. The next. Watch out. Watch out for it. Oh, yeah. no, no. Guard for us. Let's go. Be able to react to the light that. Mash against yeah, it. Yeah, 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 so that's yeah, what you need to do. Yeah. Meter advantage. On yeah. the second round, you didn't need to spend 200 to win. Are you having to spend that 100 on the, gr uh, the guard? Was being very cautious. Oh, yeah. Fireball's angled at, his, at that right spacing there. It was so now far able away. to keep it going, but couldn't get the full combo. So, see, Fireball has to make them burn meter, stay their turn, and will lose yes. the cycle yes. at the very end. Yes. Oh, no. Great shield. Challenging. Getting the 2 2. You have. Oh, funny, no tech. Okay, but a good 2A really press. Yeah, that's, that's what really you bad. have to respect that Arya's challenges have been so on point. Mario, you have the cycle still. You did it at like the perfect time. No, no shield right scary. there. So now we'll have to burn it a little bit later. Good shield on the shield. Oh, Corp at the 6 space down. That's a really big hit. It's nowhere near enough. Arya's going to have Celestial as well. So this this is anyone's game right now. It's yeah. really scary. I do like that IW. Just cash out for as much damage as you can because you only need one more big kill. Oh, that's all you like need! That. That's all you need! He gets a throw! Let's go, NorCal. Let's go, NorCal. That was tight. That was tight. That was a really good match. That was really, really good. That, that was, really, was good. really, really good. I very impressive Aria in that match. That yeah. was much better it, than I thought he was going to do against Mario. Like, it's a... I, th it's a big come up because Arya, I think, is someone who is playing phone on at like a le uh, the closest to silent right now out yep. of all the people yep. and showing that, hey, even in this kind of like what is traditionally a hard matchup for the phone ons, almost able to take it. It was literally a one interaction difference. That, if Mario got hit there, yep. he easily could have died. 100% would have died. Easily. But he got the throw, so yeah. he's still in. He's in winner's it's top eight. Oh, that's tight. That's yeah, tight. it is very tight. You know what else is tight? Clinton versus Gamer One. Game Gamer O One. Oh, Gamer O One. My mistake. Gamer O One. My Gamer mistake. One. What's What's Gamer One's real tag? I honestly don't know. You don't know? I don't know. Then I'm not gonna tell okay. you. Okay. Yeah. I'll say Gamer One. Yeah. I'll say Gamer One. I'm Maybe only, I'll recognize because them. Because I'm only like 90 percent sure who it is. You're only 90 percent sure. Uni players and their funny tags. I know. Uni well, so the, the lore behind it is that I'm pretty sure if this is who I think it is. Uh, 
forgot their start GG login info last year. No, that's on their start.gg. I checked it and I was like, well, oh, no, I forgot my, my ID. No, no, so they forgot their ID last year, had to register with an old one, and then this year signed it up and then changed their tag since that to Gamer01. It's a nice tag. I like it. It's a, it, it's a very good tag. It's a start GG default tag. That's so funny. Yeah. That's so funny. It's like Guilty Gear player. Yeah, it's Guilty Gear player. That's tight. It, uh, Klim, back. though, yeah. also pretty tight. Yeah. So I'm earlier in the winner's side. And now, oh, I didn't see the other character. It's a character that you know well if you've been in the Pacific Northwest or seen matches happen up there. Maybe a bald man oh, might play that Yuzu. character. A bald man does play that character. Yeah. He kind of knows this matchup pretty good, though, doesn't he? He does, because he's had to play against work, right? This is yeah. something that you've had to, like, if you're up there, you have to fight that person to make it to the brackets. So you have to know how this user e comp works, and they're going to work very efficiently on it right now, keeping Gamer01 in the corner. And the first thing you saw was a really nice flight angle, yep. catching out Yuzu in the slash. Oh, the frame trap, he pushed on the 4B? Interesting. Yeah, it's a it's a very like confident match. Like thinking, like, hey, I think you're gonna try to do something a little saucy early on. But Klim always just keeping it tight right here, to checking those ankles with those lows, and ended the first round with a perfect. You know, sometimes you just hit the other guy. Yeah, that's what you need to do. That's you what need to do. You win by hitting the other guy. Yeah. Oh, nice shields. A pro tip: defeating your opponent's health bar has you win the game. Check out the unique tutorial. Teach Second you that. pro tip: don't get hit. Don't get just hit. Like yeah, Klim yeah, just like yeah. Klim just did. That's bad. Yeah. Ooh. Oh, Celestial, yes. very scary. Sit very oh, comfy oh. for them right now. Good toss. Yeah, it was a safe jump. It looked like a safe jump, you know? It was definitely not a danger jump. Right? Right. I'm, danger. I'm, not, I'm not sure if it was a safe jump specific, but that was a safe anti air option, right? They're getting a big counter hit. Big combo, too. You know, you got 200, you got worms, 3.7 plus babies out. And Flight Oki right there with a double flight. Oh, the VO! You get to punish so much recovery now. Yeah. So much. The combo was all the way above you. You did it. You died. Oh, you didn't die for it. But it's pretty close. He's That's all the way up there again. Yeah, but you have to be careful, right? Like, you can't be at that right spacing to get IW'd. Were you blocking? You sure were. And Gamer01 looking close to their name right now because they're currently 01 to Clem. Yeah, they are. <laughs> Hopefully, they don't have to make a new account of Date Gamer02. Yeah, you'll have to see right now, they're, it's, it's the timeline may be looking like it's coming through, but we can see if they can open oh stuff up. Oh my god! You're you not did fuzzy you're mash against a Yuzu from the Pacific Northwest? Come on! You still have the cycle and you're yeah, hit like yeah. one time, so it's like, it's okay. You're fine. But like, you know, you gotta. I oh. did fuzzy mash against the Pacific Northwest! That one's really bad. That, that one is bad because now you've lost the cycle. Your grid broke and you're in a very dangerous situation. You're facing against these mix-ups. You weren't sure which side they were going to land on. They're going high, low. No one knows except for Gamer. Oh, one. Doesn't even spend, you know? Confident. Confident's like, ah, I got yeah. 200. I'm showing. Oh, and they'll hold yeah. the mix. Real air mix. And now looking at new like, stuff. Looking like the complete opposite of last game with that new stuff. Being in full control. Tried to 5B, but it's not going to connect right there. Flip. TK flip, you know, like you're yeah. doing something round start. I know. Crazy. You only gotta hit back though, so that's pretty yeah, good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Clip cycle lead. Like worms said, out. Like we've been saying, Clem is not one who will allow those big losses to get them, and they're yeah. willing to stay under control. Clem doesn't get tilted, Clem doesn't fold, Clem gets really funny air hits. Yep, yep, just like that. And has the ability with that CS and just their general game knowledge to fully convert over to them. Oh! Frightening. I like that because a lot of people are just gonna try to deal with the worms right there. Uh, but being able to use the aerosol to try to bait out a lot of those options because EO is pretty common for users. Yep, now we're just seeing some standard button pressure, but Clem actually gets hit by the big slash in FF. Corner route for Yuzu. User sometimes, I forget if it changed this version, but last version, the, the mid-screen routes were way better than the corner routes. Yeah, it, it's changed a little bit, if I remember correctly, but it's still, I think, mid-screen routes are uh, a little bit more consistent for players. Muscle memory, just like Clem is very consistent, knowing that 623C will kill. Put them now at match point. It's a 5 oh, whiff. Gamer one not ready, but, you know, gets the head afterwards. That's pretty good. I'd spend here. Doesn't. No, just wants to save it, wants to guarantee that they can close out a round with that know, one. You've got a lot of time. If you get a cycle, you get a ton of meter. First hit, I think yeah. it's pretty reasonable. At least 100. And especially with how aggressive they are on their CS usage, always popping it basically whenever they get a chance. Good VO right there, the Uni Classic. Oh, good, good block. See, yeah. Oh my god, is that not a punish? Do you not get a punish on that? Oh, and Worms will allow you to potentially get a pickup, but you don't have it, so instead, we'll catch those ankles. 
A little scrambly right now. Game on one still. The oh. VO. Oh my god, that could have actually comboed and been an IW and Kim would have been dead. Yeah. But you know, even on, on, on that, that, was, that fireball was super scary because even IW on that gap is there unblockable. Like you're in such a rough time. Worms that once again. All the way up. All the way. Oh, back just, dash in the air. I love it. Just walk away. Don't even just say, hey, I'm really confident that you're just going to be going here. But I want to go away from these worms. Oh, the shields. Oh, oh too yeah. Early. Good stuff, Clem. Yeah, good stuff, Clem. Gamer 01. Dead. Dead. Gamer 02. The cannon's already prepped. We're shooting them into the sun. Gone, gone, gone. Clem staying alive. Yeah, that's top eight. Is that top eight? Because Clem lost up top. Clem lost in the qualifier? He did. Yeah, he lost in the oh qualifier. So he moved back down here. So these, I believe, are our losers top eight qualifier matches. So good stuff. That's ninth place. That's ninth place. For, for, for Gamer 01. Good performance. Great performance. Yeah. Clem, though. Better performance. Yes. Metal obtained. Metal Money obtained. obtained. More time to play games. Another, another medal to add to the collection. Yeah. He's got a few. One or two. At least. This year. Yeah. 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 Next up, though. Next up. Rakir versus Anison. Anison. It's going to be interesting. Because like, I've always I've seen them play before, but it's always been the Enkidu Waldstein matchup. I haven't oh, seen yeah, the one yet. You see, it's so funny because in the loser's path, in the CG loser's path, yeah. there was like two walls. Yeah. So I was really interested in how like the walled Enkidu match would go. Because I feel like Enkidu would be pretty happy with that. I feel yeah. like up kicks and FF, pretty comparable anti airs. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And Perry is just like, you know, wall's going to dash, see, and clap at me. Whoa. Doesn't care about yep. it. Doesn't yep. Care about yep. It. But Lundrakia, he probably smokes Walt. I think he does. And I think yeah. that's a, a very big, big problem. Like, I feel Walt. like you can purposely smoke Walt. I think you can accidentally L smoke Walt. Lundrakia just naturally creates a lot of gaps that are hard for Walt to punish due to spacing purposes, right? Like, Walt does have those faster grab options that can normally, if you're up close, deal with. But Lund is spaced at this, like, perfect range. And a lot of times, of his anti-spacing option is just to backdash. Yes. Charo's not going to beat backdash. Sometimes you're going to get punished for that and in this version. Yeah, so if you're, if you're backdashing, you're holding on 5BB, holding on uh, J3C, like all those different forward moving tools, any I form of ice skating that comes through, it's terrifying. Like, you know, wall sign, what are you going to do? Are you going to power wave against it? Maybe. You know, power it's pretty tight. You can, but then you, you're, if you're, they have meter, it's a risk. Uh, uh, reaction Ice Storm on a power oh, geyser. Uh, 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 yeah. Yeah. Ice Storm's, yeah, that's a move. Yeah. That's a move. Oh, man. I didn't even think about that. Yeah. yeah you can just do that. Wall sign, what are you going to do? Yeah. What, what are you going to Air do? Air grab. Aircraft. That is something that you could do. We'll see if uh, you know Tannis can figure that out right now. They're just playing very cautious, trying to find these bigger buttons on these jumping attempts right now. You know, doing pretty good. Yeah, yeah. Oh, this jump back. You know, that was pretty nice until you got hit, and now you're in the corner. But I like how Tannis is playing the neutral right now. If he's able to escape the dangers of Waldstein, like using a really, really slow OS, uh, it could go pretty well. Plus turns to the EX. Gets a good throw off it. Oh. oh, skating around. Watch out. Well, you know, Rakir's doing really good this round. Yeah. Rakir damage. Rakir has just been a capitalizer on every single hit, on all these opportunities, trying to TRM, but it's not going to work out just yet. Grab. Uses that 360A. Power wave. Power wave. Oh. Yeah. Rakir oh. just moving around. Nice jump over the fireball. Yeah. I really oh. like that as an option. It, oh, it jump is. over the five B. It's really, really good, especially because once you're in the air, people are also worried about Body Splash CS. You have a lot of different tools. Walled in the air is a very, very scary character. Just backs off now, trying to keep it going. Can't grab off that back dash, but you oh. can't hold this Ice Storm. Didn't punish. I thought 4B would have been a little slow. You know, you get the punish in the Ice Storm, yeah. not enough. But you know, you got your plus strength, you got your hit. Slash and confirm with the EX. Oh, I guess the combo as well. No resets needed. 3.6, that's good round star. You're building meter back already. Hang oh. out, you know? You're not going to connect at the end of the headstone, but you will right here with a good old-fashioned reversal 360A into the CS as well. Going to be some big damage here. Yeah, guy in time. VO Ender. Interesting. Yeah, so it works out. It does work out because uh, you don't be able to strip anymore, but it does remove two blocks of grid. So you gain an advantage off that. You're going to guarantee yourself a cycle right here. Immediately cash it out. Refund that meter you just spent. Oh, we saw good shields by spending EX to keep yourself safe. Keep yourself plus. Roll getting tagged. Oh, but okay. just swipes. Just normal swipes yeah. on Waco. Oh, and a meaty. What you doing? You're sending out vegetables in this day and age? Come on. <laughs> There's grains. There was, there was vegetables. Grains and beans. No, no protein, though, on the table right here. And Worker needs that for that deadlift. You do. You do. 
Oh, Ice Run. This we set up our flower. Not needy as well. Oh, and no green uh, shield throw. Punish right there. You got a oh. tier M though, and you got the cycle, and yeah. you got a big hit from the CS. Back into the corner, back with a flower. What's it gonna be? He's pushing about waiting for Tanner to do something crazy like that, but it's gonna work out in their favor this time. Punish as well. Very nice. This is big damage too. This is big damage. Yeah. Rakir's in the corner. Hunter has got a DP. Not a DP for throw though. Yeah, oh, that's the, a good DP, the DP for throw. The DP is even scarier in this matchup though, because a lot of the walls do want to go for just that like dash 360 on your wake up and uh It'll die. Yeah, Lawn, It'll die. Lawn DP is not throw in It's the only one that is not. Thank goodness. Yeah, it was. Thank goodness. Button DP, absolutely yeah. not. Uh, five B, also uh, neutral button. You know, yeah. it's like, what's Wall Sign gonna do in the neutral against five B? I hold don't it. know. The answer is hold it or jump out and try to avoid being in that situation. Yeah. The jump earlier was really nice, but yeah. as soon as Rakir is able to adjust the spacing enough, you're just gonna get punished. Oh yeah, and a great backdash right there. Being able to avoid the body splash, no cancel opportunities, no options at all. Tannison has to hold all of this mix right here. Flower keeping it safe. Oh, clap. You were plus, but you know, really far for Walt. Really far. He's got some big arms. Not yeah. as big as Rakir, though. No, the big... Not as big as Rakir, no, though. Big, yeah. Wald, Wald, Wald could not spot him. No. Wald could not spot him. Rakir looking so confident in this match. Set point. Oh, tag in the air with the Rekka. That first hit of the spin, it's hit so high. You just tag wall sign like that. Now you're able to strike throw. You know, that works both ways. Yep, 360s are un, uh, unmixed upable for this left right. Yeah, just works. Oh, oh, man, really, really nice try to catch on the back dash, but you know, yellow throw. Unfortunate. Yeah, went for 360B. I think you're expecting like a, a bigger counter hit punish to not get the uh, the tech window. But Rakir just played it very, very cautious right there. And now set, set up, up the flower. Strike throw. You know you're yeah. hanging out. Walton's got a freezy debuff. Dead. Yeah. yeah. Dead. A clean Overhead. 2 0 with the last wreck up right there. Rakir moves on top eight loser side. Good stuff. Good stuff. Tannison. Good performance. Yep, yep, yep. Ninth. Strong yep. stuff. Strong stuff. Excellent work. Excellent work. We have a lot of good matches. We, we have nothing but good matches. There's not it's been crazy. a match that's played that has been like super one sided anyone. Like, even though all these 2 0s that we've had have been like pretty convincing that anyone could hit it. Yeah, 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 yeah. Speaking about anyone, and Aria everyone. saw before, yep. lost to Mario. Yep. Snappy is the opponent this time. More NorCal. More NorCal. More NorCal. But are you gonna, not are you as gonna... strong of a Wagner. Just, I think we can. Kind whoa, of, whoa, I think, whoa. I think Snappy's Wagner is not as good as Mario's. I think that's not a, whoa, an whoa, unpopular whoa. take. Mario's take was that Real, okay. he's afraid. He was at Genesis, you know, earlier this yeah. year. He was very afraid about fighting Snappy because he really? thinks Snappy's really good with the Wagner okay. matchup in the mirror. Okay. I stand corrected. Well, Snappy's nice with it at Wagner. They got, that, I think they got that dog in them. I'd love him to have that dog in him. Yeah. I feel like he's probably going to pick Wagner instead of Chaos. I, 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 but, you I know, I'd like to see, to see the dog. I'd like him for, to believe. But you're, you know what I really want to see is I want to see him swap. <laughs> I want to see him like swap if he loses. I think yes. swapping yes, when yes, you yes. lose is so overpowered. It, it is very very good. Even if you're swapping to a weaker character, because it forces your opponent completely to, adapt. To completely you know how adapt. they're playing. Yeah. Who knows how you're gonna play on this new funny dog character? Exactly. Especially with with the dog is being played less. Like you said, it's a character that has shown up as a little bit weaker. So a lot of players are switching off them, which means that tech isn't as developed. If you're hiding it in your pocket, as well as just like not giving those people those matchups, they might not know how to fight it as well. Yeah, you know, if you're not used to that, if you're not used to chaos, it's a little, it's a lot harder this version because yep. you lost one AD. You can't yep. just shield the dog for free. And it's up, a little, little oh, up in PNW, we don't have a hyper consistent chaos player. We do have a Clover Wolf who's out there and likes playing the puppet characters, but they're not a big uni grinder. Right, they're focused on a lot of other games. So I don't know 100% how much experience Arya has in that particular matchup. But we saw the Wagner select. We're seeing the Bidaki Athena. Yeah. Yep. I think Didn't the get changed too much. I think the Wagner is...
the most. The, the it's the best pick. first op option. Well, I also think you just, pick that first. Yeah, just with how good this matchup is. But also, Arya doesn't have advantage. They're already prepared for this matchup mentally. They just Arya, went through it. Arya did really well against Mario. Yeah. Wasn't able to win, but was very close. It was Stappy down on the other side now. Counter throw. I like it. I don't like getting on the other side because of that assault, but you know, mix. Oh, great. 5A right there. Fainting that strike throw. Super duper delay. Oh, the drop. I don't like that drop. That's a bad drop. That's a bad confirm. But you know, it was a good hit. Snappy has the cycle, but now Arya's going to big ol' combo. 3.1. Snappy into corner. Just keeping the pressure right now. Looking to potentially go in, uh, back into that install for those three plus frames. Keep in the corner. Oh, no single no hit DP? I feel like you could have DP'd that. Nice run up yeah. 2B. I think 2B is a pretty underrated button. It, so it, it actually got better. It was a very not, not better. It was, no. a, it was not a, that good of a button in the last version, but it got improved in, uh, in Uni 2. Speaking of improve things, IW to clean it up. Yeah. Kill. Aria round one. Pretty good, you know, DP round star also pretty good. You get a pickup, 2.7. He got okay. counter hit for that. He got counter hit for that. Ay, ay, ay. Yeah. Right. I want Snappy to win a round right now. Well, let's we'll see if they can make that comeback because Arya's continuing this pressure, showing, hey, it's my round to win 6 6 e into the cancel. Pop CBO, CBO late cancel. That's pretty You're funny. You're so smart. That's pretty You're funny. So smart, I'll Arya. give it up. I'll give it up. That's pretty funny. Swap! <laughs> I want to see. I want to see chaos. Go, go, to go, go, go to character side. Go to character side. Do, do it. Hit rematch. 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 Believe. Go. Yeah. <laughs> Going to character like smart. You know, you save time. You bring that momentum. That was a really wacky round start. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Yes. Let's go, Norco. He's gonna Let's smoke go, him. Yeah. He's gonna smoke him. Look at this dog walk him. Well, yeah. I don't even need the dog. Five A. Oh, trade, amazing, but no incredible. Dog, no dog combos, so not a ton He's got of those no dog combos. You don't get a ton, but you know, your dog's yes. back. But you find a 5A of your own, and a big counter hit. Arya saying, hey, I don't need to readapt. I've already got you downloaded here. That was a pretty good assault. It was pretty good. Spending 100, 4K, pretty we have good. CS as well. No, 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 we fuzzy mash in this region. We fuzzy mash here. Do not try your fake options. Oh, that dropped a little bit. That was weird. But the second hit's pretty good. The you, second hit's pretty you, good. Yeah, yeah, Snappy's yeah, yeah. got a kill right now. Yeah. CS, a little extra meter on top. Take some of that. Get, that that's a coupon right there. 10% off. The dog's here. Yeah. Watch out. We haven't even seen dog neutral. No, we haven't even seen dog FF because you don't need it. Yeah, you just need that six seats. The Snappy's been showing them the knowledge. The got Ferraris the knowledge. in their garage, have books on their shelves. Check them out. Oh, oh, he's nice with it. I'm going home. I'm going he's home. He's so nice with it. You don't need dog if you just know how to play good on your character oh. and you get mixed. I didn't see the dog. The dog's not there. Yeah. You're dead for that. The dog's off screen. It's not real. Perfect. Fast. Killer. Bring it home. Check, check Snappy's stick for the game shark. I think I think there was a little bit of cheating right His there. His stick? He's a normal old pad player. A stick. A legal device. No modifications. It, 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 PlayStation sanctioned. Dual Shock 5? Dual Shock 4. Dual Shock 4? Dual check shock it. I need four. to see. Uh, do we have Buttercade on? Or is it uh, Buttercade and Beaver? Uh, there's a, the pad modders out there. There's that one guy in Street Fighter who had a flash kick uh, macro bound on his right trigger. I don't see Chaos with a flash kick. I do see Chaos getting hit. That's a little unfortunate. You know, some good pressure from Aria. Yeah. But uh, Snappy is, like, nice with it. Okay, that was a good throw. Well, I'll give that up. Aria's looking pretty nice with it as well right now, keeping the pressure going. Oh, trade, bad trade, bad yeah, trade, and bad trade. trade in Aria's favor as well, getting the full confirm off it as well. Spending 100, you get your 25 back, really nice. Yeah, oh, catch it! Block. No, how did that not go under? This is a construction zone, where's your helmet? Hard PPE required. <laughs> you know, I'll agree, Snappy's been hitting a hit by assault a decently large amount. He has not really been able to play dog neutral, unfortunately. No, but it, so far it's been working out for him, so I don't think he's even need to switch up. Need, to oh, here we go. Yeah. Dog is in. It's active. It's active. Yeah, both Let's see the dog save. breath. Uh, I, uh, oh, two C. Yeah, yeah, that's pretty good. That's pretty good. Buttons are good. Knockdown. Dogs on the other side. Sandwich. A good tech out. But we'll get hit back tech into out. the dog. Norcal. You know what they say about Norcal? They say, they say things about the Abaro. Oh, he dropped that a little yeah, bit. Yeah, you're it's a fine. bunch of mashes. That's what y'all are. Whoa! <laughs> an Arya shield and Whoa. a little... Oh, that guy's oh, no, it's get over, it's over, punished. It's over, it's over. Punished. You know who's at 200 meter right now? 
Yeah. It was at 200 meter right now. Yep. It's NorCal. Yep. Spend 100 plus frames. Arya still got a chance to get make it out. Gets a Ooh. jump out. Not oh, able to punish so. The book connects. Look at that big old disc. Oh, man. Scary. Strike throw. Draw strong. Strike throw. Oh, oh my god. The hypnosis. I'm going to shield to anti air. I'm going to shield to anti air. It's so good. Oh, the mix. The mix. Snappy's so nice with it. Yeah. But they're happy. The, the, yeah, they're good. If they're Arya happy. had to lose anyone, it, would, it should have been Snappy. So you it was know. a great it was set. A great you set. know, fantastic. Showing hey, chaos, mid mid tier, not low tier anymore. You know, if you don't need the dog neutral, yeah. the dog doesn't get killed by five yeah. A. Use use some buttons. Use some good stuff. Use some good tools right there. Let's go NorCal. Let's go Prem. Let's not go Prem. Uh, Prem. I think he's gonna lose to Rurik, but you know, I, I have hope. I have hope in my heart. I don't. I do not have hope for Prem here. You know, I have hope he for did work. lose. He did lose to the SoCal Eltman earlier. Yeah. But he's he's going to fuzzy mash against the Yuzu from Pacific Northwest. He is. In my heart of hearts, I believe that he's going to fuzzy mash good. Yeah. And I, I, you don't need to fuzzy mash good too many times. You need to do it like... Twice. No, but I think and then things change. The thing is, is you we've only been able to see the Rurik fuzzy mash game plan or the Rurik game plan work to beat people who aren't fuzzy mashing. Rurik has more tricks up his sleeve. He, he has adaptation. So if he knows and if he's played Prem, he knows that Prem knows how to deal with that stuff. He can bring those tools out early on and force Prem to get blown up by making those kind of options. I think so. In this game right now, opportunities are limited. Yes. You don't have a ton of time in some games to get those information and get those levels going up. Yeah. Because you die so fast. Yep. So if you get fuzzy mashed, Prem's got 200, you might just die. Yeah, that is true. You might true. just die. But the same goes both ways. If you activate that layer just right time, Prem might die. Yeah. It's volatile. It'll be it'll be very interesting to see, you know, who can fully clutch it out. Prem's picking. Oh, his color. This is not his color. That's not your color! What are you doing? Go back! He didn't go back. I don't know. It's not his color. It's not his color. I don't get it. I don't get it. He needs to change his color. But he's going to win. Let's go NorCal. Let's go NorCal indeed. Why are you cheering? What? No, you should cheer for PNW. I'm fine with that. You know, you we know can both be biased I here. I love NorCal. I, I'm here to say it. I love PNW, but I also love NorCal. Rook's doing it really nice right now. Good yeah. strike after that kick combo. Has the cycle. Uh, Rook, you know, personally, uh, I don't know if Prem's got it. Well, we'll have to find we'll out have right to see. We'll now. To see. Yeah, because like Prem can make those adaptations, make the changes. That's a good start that's right a, there. That's a really good button. You yeah. know, that's part of like the dark book that Prem owns is I have a really big three hit low. <laughs> Watch my hidden tome attack <laughs> you. <laughs> <and> <laughs> feet. The dark book known as the Eltham character move list. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. Oh, jumps over it. Yeah. Doesn't get a punish though. Dash seat. Oh, good 2A. Didn't Some two, good old passion of RA. He didn't 2-2A two, two after it. That's the thing you do and then the other person dies, but he didn't do it. He didn't do it. He knows now. Oh, scary. Oh, uh, yeah, two yeah, it's. Yeah. Two it's. That's good. You know, that's yeah. a good mix. It's good, but it's it, this is a download route for him, right? He's got to figure out, like, okay, how can I deal with work? What is the game plan that work wants to bring in versus me today? How oh, do I right deal under. with what's going on? And that's a great start for Prem. Good punish. That's a good punish. You fell down right into my arms. The loving embrace of Prem. Air throw. Oh, he doesn't actually get bullets off of this route. A little unfortunate. Jumping around each other. Yeah, Prem got tagged by slashes. Yeah. That happens. See, that's what I'm scared about. You saw that 2FF? Yeah. I'm afraid if Prem's, like, starting on offense and Rook's chilling, 2FF's going to smoke him. Yes, and, it's, and 2FF has been such a good tool for users in this game, and Rook is, like, is one of 2FF and, like, the best of them. Oh, yeah. But, you know, also, strike throwing, really good. Oh, blocker that time. Good job. Oh, so scary! Got the punish cutting sinks. Too fast. But you already see all those gameplays where Rook versus other people will be going for the charge delay. See, recognize that, hey, Prem's going to fuzzy match. We're already seeing those adaptations in gameplay. We're already seeing these wonderful 2A presses from Rook right here, but can't close it out just yet. Prem's got a chance. Cutting sink. Cutting sink. Cutting sink again. He's his life. Oh my god, he got an early reload. That's an interesting routing option. I like it. You got your frame. Oh, good jump. Oh, just a good old run up dash throw. Yeah. You know, you neutral jumped over low and then dash throw. That yeah. was Street Fighter. That was Street Fighter. Footsies. That was great. Those footsies. We're showing the Street Fighter 5 footies. Okay, I believe. I, I believe this will be a better game, I think. 
I think this would be a better game. We got some chanting going. Yeah. Oh, that was a really nasty 5C there. I hope you all can hear the, the conflicting chants happening in the background right now. Well, but these players are not letting it get to them. Hopefully not. You know, Rook's in a combo, no headphones. A little drop. Let her reset. Let her reset. That's pretty good. It's a good reset to have right there, because now you're basically getting a free five, like 5k damage combo when it's only going to be like 3.8. Yeah. Oh, dash C. Dash C, goaded button. Goaded button. It is Doesn't really good. It's a, it's, it covers a lot of stuff that the users want to be doing in that range due to the longer startup, and you can you know, get it out confidently. But the big connection on the Ooh. overhead's great for Prem. Oh, that's uncharted. It's not an over. That's a mid. That's just a hey, bodega. Hey, 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 Watch hey, out. Watch your head. Hey, 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 hey. 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 Recycle secured. Watch my purple bullets. Shoot. Yeah. Oh, he didn't. oh my god, he didn't 2 2 that time, but he didn't need to. Ah, he had the no cancel, but Rook oh with a dash god, C right the there. Cycle. He has a cycle. He can cancel and be plus for free and get the kill. Oh my god, he's dead. Yeah, into the IWAX. Show it off. Be fancy. Oh my god, he's dead. He's, the, he's like so close. But I feel like so many of his like small, like, this is my mix-up chance decision. They're just going wrong, but he hits these big neutral hits with the yep. EX wire. Yep. But he needs to keep that advantage. He needs to press it forward. And if he does, uh, he got purple bullets, he's gonna win. Nice throw. Yeah. And this is a great spot for him to be in. Charge, dive kick, gonna connect. This is Prem's round to take, but he can't he finish it. He drops it. That's classic Prem, he drops it. He needs to win another interaction now. That's an, oh my god, it was delayed, but, but no, punish. no punish. too far out, so that EXD is going to stay safe right there. Before it's Prem in the corner, throw combo time. Throw combo's pretty good, you know? You got, you got a lot oh, of cycle. Oh, reset. Alive. He's alive. It's fine. It's, it's a two-hit game right He's now. He's alive, but not for long. Rourke's hitting at basically 100 meter right here with the cycle. Oh, he footsies. Footsies. That guy got second in Koahime. He knows how to hit people's toes. But oh can't my god, he doesn't know how to combo. No oh, got to that's all you need. That's all you need. That's all you need. Okay, see, that's not even the game, though. That's like a round. Yeah, Rook's still at yeah. set point. Yeah, yeah. It's scary. I'm a, I'm afraid for my for my region's life. Well, you yeah, see right now, you still have some couple boys giving you a run through, but Rook looking to shut this one down right now with this combo. Okay. It's a good combo, spending 100, you know, yeah. you got to build more meter to build meter. Oh, but you also have to Ooh. punish them when they try to do any kind of off. Just like Rurik has been playing perfect oh my defense God, no. and aggression this entire set. Are we going to see? Is it? No, there's no. There. I think there's, there's a no way. There's no way. It's not, there's though. No, there's it's no not. Way. There's no way. There's no way. It's not. Check the tape. Yeah, yeah, yeah we're, okay. good. We're, we're good. good. We're good. We're good. Okay, but you know, Rurik has like all the life, and Prem yeah. has like none of the life. I've, I've seen this man play, play Don't Touch oh. Me for 80 seconds, but they won't need it as they get a TRM right at the very end. Rurik qualifying in through that loser's side top eight. Great showing. Eight. I didn't believe in Prem. Uh, he you never fuzzy mashed because he didn't need to. But it's your fault for not believing in NorCal. I believed in PNW that time, and PNW That's made true. it in the that top is eight. True. That Rurik, is true. great competitor. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And here, here's Prem. That's not Prem. That's CJ. Oh my god. Oh my god. It scared the hell out of me. I believe that's more PNW showing up for uh, top eight. Oh. Yeah. Good for PNW. Oh, no, good for PNW. Oh. NorCal's in winner's side. Thankfully. NorCal. NorCal. What? NorCal's in you want, you want, winner's side. Chico? Thankfully. You know. You know. There's a. There's a lot of. There's a lot of representation for PNW, huh? Isn't that, isn't that crazy? I don't think y'all being clear lamp, though. Yeah, but I don't think y'all being. Knots, if you don't think, if you, if you don't think, uh, uh, we're we'll gonna clear lamp. I don't think you'll be clear lamp either. I'm just saying. Yeah, I'm, I'm commentating. Yeah, I'm commentating. Yeah, yeah, but I'm commentating. But your but your uh, your, your NorCal isn't commentating. They're not gonna be clear lamp either. I'm just saying. But yeah, anyway, we're gonna we're gonna, to, gonna we're gonna see we're gonna see you later. We're gonna see yeah, we're gonna see who beats clear lamp or who doesn't beat clear lamp yeah, yeah, yeah. in top eight. You know, coming what? up next, not this stream. On the, on, main the on the main stream. Guildhouse stream. Go to Guildhouse. But hold on, I can't. I can't sign off for you guys. It's got to be Tabby. Yeah, give it back to Tabby. All right, all right. Excellent stuff there. Congrats to all of our top eight competitors mm -hmm, here mm -hmm. at Slashback Volume Two. I think for us, this is it for the weekend. Yeah, we're we're, out. we're done. We're out. Only thing left is Uni Top Eight. eight. The Last goat, game. The goat go. ending us off. Shout out to Brett for scheduling it like that, making sure the best game is saved for last. I have been Tabby. I've been deep. No, you're, I, uh, you're an automatically bad entrant. I've been us off. Moderately okay entrant, commentating, playing. Thanks for watching. Yeah. We'll catch you at top eight. Stay tuned on the other stream, not this one. See you next time.